had time for it. And I, hello. <laughs> I literally haven't, I haven't, I haven't had time for a wee. Oh. Hello. Good I evening. I, I don't even know if everything's on because I've been rushing about. I'm not even dressed from like the pocket down. Uh, and I've, just, I've literally, literally, with about 10 seconds to go, just rushed into the studio and easy at all, half asleep. Don't expect much from Sean tonight. <laughs> Do you want to tell him or shall I? I'm not telling them. How long have I known Sean? So coming up to 32 years I've known Sean. Blimey, we've been young a long time, haven't we? We have been young a long time. And I have never seen him as drunk <laughs> last night, ever, than I have in a whole 32 years that I've known him. He was that drunk last night. I literally, I knew there was something up when I went to collect him <laughs> from the old people sing a, sing a song thing <laughs> that he goes to on a Friday night once a month <laughs> with the other old age pensioners from the community. Oh. And I, I knew there was something up because he was holding on to the railings out, <laughs> so outside the community centre, weren't you? Golf club, not a community centre. So all the other old biddies had got the wheelchairs. So I knew there was something when I collected him because he was holding on. And he kind of staggered with the help of a couple of other uh, special needs people from the local community <laughs> into the car, just, just talking absolute gobbledygook. I nearly said bollocks, but it's too early for that. <laughs> It was Justin's fault. And I had to drive really slow because he said it was like a roller coaster. So I had I had my finger on the window ready to, to open, open it, it just in case. And then we got home and he literally fell out of the car and then I had to I had to carry him. I've hurt my thumb from the car back to the house and he hurt his thumb because he tried taking his jumper off at when the I was side sat of the on bed the bed and just carried on with the jumper. <laughs> Bang on the floor. And ended up on the floor. <clears throat> so that was about quarter past 11 last night. He woke up, well, he got up at about half past 11 this morning, so 12 and a bit hours later. I got up at half past 11, laid on the settee, and I were asleep again by 12 o'clock. Yeah, literally half an hour after he got up, fast asleep again on the, so on the sofa. Oh. We don't say sofa, we say settee, we're northerners. Yeah. So uh, anyway, I thought that uh, that it, it might be worth just having, like before we get going, a, a minute silence for Sean's liver. Oh dear uh, me! On the left is Sean's liver yesterday. On on the right is well, it's just <laughs> it's just full of Johnny Walker Black Label, according to that photo. So and, and what's he been doing all day to try and to try and improve his liver? Eating chicken pakoras. <laughs> I needed something spicy. I'll give you something spicy. <laughs> you wouldn't be able to cope at the moment, would you? <laughs> no. So if he looks a bit glazed every now and then and just and just goes quiet or a little bit pale, then then you know why. <laughs> I'll be fine. Hello, by the way. <laughs> this <laughs> we're missing all these comments. I'm so sorry. Uh, Kitty Cat Chat says it was the Darby and Joan Club. It, 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 <laughs> he wishes it was as fashionable as the Darby and Joan Club, I tell you. <laughs> uh, sure, uh, Lee, Lee Ray says, uh, air of the dog is what you need. Oh, I can't, no. I'm on orange juice. I can't face any more alcohol. I'm on alcohol. Ah. Uh, welcome back, Sean. Thank you. Uh, Heidi says that's hilarious. Rest in peace, Sean's liver. Let's <laughs> <laughs> just go through it. Uh, welcome back. I was bad. Uh, it's Tom's birthday. Happy birthday Ooh. to Tom. Uh, Lady of the Trillium says it sounds like Sean had a great time. I'd had a fantastic time. Well, anything kind of pre-11 o'clock yesterday night was good, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> he did wake up with the mop bucket at the side of the bed. Yeah, I woke up and I thought... What's the mop bucket doing there? And one of the big dog's waterproof blankets, you know, <laughs> just in the case. Carpets. Just in case. The carpets have only been down two years. I'm I know. Not, <laughs> I'm not vaxxing them or... Yeah. Uh, Joe says, so funny. Give that man a drink, says Claire. I don't no. think he wants one. I don't want one today. I think I'm going to lay off it for a week. Uh, Catherine. Oh, hello, uh, Catherine. Rosé whiskey has that effect. It wasn't that, actually. It wasn't that one. We haven't even started on that. And thank you for the gift. It was lovely meeting you. Yeah, we, we met these yesterday. We did. Yesterday? Catherine and Tony. Yeah, it was before the... It's like the event now, isn't it? That, that yes. Will, that will go down in... There was only one before this that wasn't as bad, and that was when he drank four bottles of wine in one night. 
That was some years ago, wasn't it? Yeah, with my ex. When I could cope with it. Yeah. Your ex stepmother. My ex stepmother. She was lovely until somebody threw some water on her and she melted. <laughs> uh, Trish Guthrie says, "Happy birthday, Tom and Beth Lowell. Happy uh, good evening, Colin. That she didn't want to come up then. She, I had to click three times. Did then. you? I had to click three times. Evening, Sean and Colin. Glad to see you and your Hummer tonight. Hum Hummer. The Hummer's Hummer. in the Hummer's in the garage, isn't it? We hadn't even Hummer. got a Hummer. We had a Jeep. Oh. Uh, rest in peace, Sean's liver. <laughs> <laughs> Sean deserves a night out. Uh, yes." And I do enjoy a night out. It's usually about once a month, but it was twice this month, wasn't it? It was twice this month. Yes. Yeah. Uh, Kelvin says, hi, lads. Mother-in-law not stopping us watching you. Say, you put her in a place. You tell her. You sit in that corner while we watch this programme. It's very educational. After you've watched it, you'll turn it off and say, well, that taught me a lesson. Uh, it's pickled. It, yes. it, actually, it actually does look a bit pickled, doesn't it? Yeah. Uh, I wonder if the bottles are actually in there. There must be quite small bottles because your liver's not that big. It probably feels it at the moment. <laughs> it feels it, yeah. Well, I don't think it's probably that big at the moment. Uh, Dave says you're a lush. I am. <laughs> uh, if we're missing any out, just comment again. We're trying to get through a, a lot of these. Uh, that's our pleasure, Tommy. What do you think the E stands for? Or is it just Tom, eh? Tom, eh? <laughs> is he from Canada, eh? <laughs> eh? Uh, so, look, good evening. Hello. Uh, Alfie Barlow, fresh from the boat show. Sounds like Sean had a great time. I did, mate, yes. You're going to have to come out with more than three words at a time. I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't do this on my own all night. <laughs> oh, dear. Hello. Come on, Alfie, stand in for us. You yeah. can, can stand in for Sean while he, goes, he has an early night. Uh, cheers from Vancouver, Canada. Glad to see Sean back from the Trent and Mersey Canal. <laughs> Yes, some people, eh? Some people, Lazar. If you don't, if you don't get that, you have to watch yesterday's vlog. And a shame on you for not watching yesterday's vlog. Uh, and B, yeah, uh, Sean apparently has left me, yeah. and he was last seen on a boat on the Trenton Mersey Canal a few days bizarre. ago. Bizarre, absolutely mm. bizarre, people. Uh, Chris Passmore says hello from a cold and wet Bank Newton top lock. Oh, we've been there. We have been there. There's a water point there, isn't that there? That doesn't look like Chris Passmore. It doesn't, does it? It looks like Curly Watts, doesn't it? It does. Hello, Curly Watts. Uh, cheers from Rufus. Here we go, then. Clink, cheers. clink. I've got, I've got whiskey. I've got a bit of Johnny Walker. No, I've tonight. just got orange juice. Suffering. It's not good. His liver's given him a, given him a final written warning today. Final written it? warning? It's fired me. <laughs> Another one. Rest in peace, Sean's liver. Yes. Uh, hi, Foxes from Munich. Hey! Good Abend. Good Abend. Uh, it's Trisha's 52nd birthday tomorrow. Happy birthday for tomorrow. Happy birthday, Trish. It's a pity we can't go and sing happy birthday to her tomorrow, it is. isn't it? Uh, Kitty Cat Chat says, oh, My husband once peed in the washing machine when drunk. <laughs> he thought we had a new front loading lavatory. <laughs> <laughs> I tried to climb in a cupboard once. Yeah. I used to have CCTV of it, and I don't know what happened. I think, I think somebody got hold of my phone, and uh, no, I didn't actually, and deleted it. What well, I wasn't pointing at you. I you was, was. I was scratching my mouth. Yeah. Something happened, and I've got an itch around my mouth now. <laughs> he did. He once. He once came in from the pub and got up at about half past one in the morning, and we had CCTV in the house, and I looked at the CCTV. And he, he took his pants down and he was No, trying, I was stark naked. You were you were trying to he was trying to sit backwards into, in the cupboard. Into one of the kitchen cupboard. He was lucky it was the pan cupboard because if it had gone to the next one along, it was the cheese grater. <laughs> That'd have woke you up, wouldn't it? Yeah. That would have woke you up, wouldn't it? Oh, that I one? do I uh, I have I have been not in the past. Oh, uh, evening from Lemonroy D and Lindsay. Good evening, Iggy. Hello. <laughs> Good Go evening. Are you? Are you? Are you? So, I had to drive him to, to co-op this afternoon because he was. I couldn't drive myself. I'd have still been over the limit. You were. We could. He couldn't drive. I couldn't put any naked flames around you. <laughs> naked flames. Uh, Shaky the gent. Hello. Evening, chaps. Really good to see you both again. Bring on the lauter. 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 <laughs> 
Uh, <laughs> Thomas gets high on communion wine. <laughs> You'd be eating all the bread, wouldn't you? You'd be taking jars of pickle lily. Bread, wine, bread, wine. I'm glad I said pickle lily then because it ne <laughs> <laughs> I nearly didn't. Uh, Claudia, uh, ha ha Hugh, Hugh, ha 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 he. Uh, Ratsters, <laughs> evening from Unsunny Nairn. <laughs> May Sean's liver recover soon. Oh, down there in there. Oh, it will be by next week, I think, won't it? There you go. Your turn. Oh, Michelle, you put your proper name now. Eh, my sister Michelle, glad to see you're drinking orange. Oh, I know, sis. It oh, I'm thirsty tonight, me. It were really, I were bad. He were. He were. His sister rang him while he were, while I were taking him to the co-op. Yeah. Just before, around lunchtime-ish. It was, yes. And, oh, you look rough. I could, Help I could see in your sister. I mean, your sister's probably seen you in some states, but even I could see it in her eyes. She was thinking, "Bloody hell!" <laughs> <laughs> Want you? I, I could see. Oh, uh, the AI shown is very, very realistic now that you split up. That was, yeah, that was yes. the other one we split up. It's quite good, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, super chat from Andrea Adams. Hello. Hey. Whoa. Hello. Yay, I made it for a live chat. I watch all of them. I just don't make it to all of them. She probably, <gasps> oh, excuse me, watches it back afterwards. No, I'm on pause. Oh, you're on pause. Uh, Why? Uh -uh. Here's a little something for your wedding fund. Wish you many more years of happiness and adventures. Love to you. Oh, love to you, Thank Andrea. You. That's from the non it chilip, just in case. Just in case. What you, why is your lip itchy? What have you been putting I, in your mouth? I don't know. I don't know. But he, he had nothing on his mouth when I saw him on TV. <laughs> uh, Thomas, he's laughing at something. Is, is he just laughing at laughing at what I've done or laughing at you? Probably. Uh, Neil Swatham says, good evening to both of you. Is that a padded door? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> not, not in this room, anyway. Uh, no, it's it's just acoustic thing. It stops it stops the rooms from sounding echoey. Eh, eh, eh. Echo, echo. Oh, you did. Echo, we had the, we had the same thought then. That's good, isn't it? Uh, global unit. It sounds like an investment firm, doesn't it? It that does. One? Uh, good evening. Hello. Good evening. Uh, explore with Paul. I'm guessing it wasn't just a wee dram last night. Several. I'm surprised they're not on here apologising. Yeah. Because I've got a bone, if you're watching, well, I've got a bone, but I've got a bone to pick with you. Why? I've, it's, it, you know why it's their fault. You're not going out with them again. I, it's because he took a hip flask, two hip flasks. Well, we're taking hip flasks at, well, we were taking hip flasks at oh, wedding. Oh, I'm not getting drunk at the wedding. Well, you're too right. Absolutely not. Too right. Oh, no. Yeah, you're not, you're not having a hip flask at the wedding. <laughs> you can have a fruit shoot. And that's it. A fruit shoot. You can have a one fruit shoot. Uh, Chris Hoffman says, "Too bad there isn't a rental liver program for those of us who are a little old." Why have you? Are you a bit of a drinker? Are you, Chris? <laughs> I'm, I'm trying to see in that little photo whether his nose is red because that's usually a giveaway. Isn't it's it? usually a giveaway. Yeah. With you, it's the swaying. The swaying. When he stands at the, the till. Swaying at the, and the falling at, down. At the you can usually notice the day after he's kind of swaying. <laughs> And his forehead sweating a little bit, <sighs> isn't it? Uh, Annie Bally says, hi, you two. It's my first time on live with you. How Ooh. do you know it's live? Because uh, we've just read a name out and she knows it's live now. Penis! <laughs> <laughs> That's how you know it's live. Thank you, Kent Brockman. Uh, Christine Duffy, hello, boys. Nice to see you and you as well. Uh, Sharon Bamber, did you have to sleep with one foot on the floor, Sean? <laughs> <laughs> no. I don't get that. Uh, you, they say if you put one foot on the floor, it stops the room spinning. All oh, right. It didn't in the car because you were saying slow this bloody roller oh, no. coaster I don't down. Know. You always say slow this roller coaster down, please. Uh, evening, fellas from Nottingham. Uh, well, we're not. We're actually from Scotland, but thank you. <laughs> Mel, cheers. Uh, hello from Matlock. <laughs> Uh, are you all right? Are you all right, sweetheart? Oh, I don't want to make yeah. you feel ill. Uh, Laura, is that Haber or Haber? I think it's Haber, isn't it? Yeah. Rhymes with. I would right. have said Haber because there's only one B in it. Rhymes with Caber. But then, then, then it's then she's American because she's in Ohio. Well, that's how you spell Caber, isn't it? Yes. That thing that you toss. Yes. Yeah. Glad to see you. It's always a blast from here in here in O. There's too many bloody H's in that in that line. We're not <laughs> having that one. I saw Sean in Aldi in Coventry the other day. 
So that's Neil Swatman. Oh, aye. In Coventry? We've got cottages in Aldi in Coventry now. Oh, right? you can't say that. I don't do that. Uh, hello, Thomas, again. Thomas is coming to the wedding. Ah, good. I've seen his sporran. His sporran? Mm. So you can't wear that. <laughs> Sean, try and stay sober for the next few days. Oh, I am. telling you what to do. You know, you know what happens when people tell us what to do? Oh, I'll end up drunk. We give them the side eye. <laughs> Glad that worked. We've been practising that all day, and that's the best version of it. He's been looking that way <laughs> for the first few hours. Try to stay sober, where are we? Uh, he used to forget the script, now you've got him ad-libbing. Is that Tauline like Pauline, or Tauline? Like As Tauline. A a tauline? I used to eat tauline sheets when I was a kid, <laughs> didn't you? I, I prefer cotton. I like a nice bit of cotton. I do. Uh, to to the loom and back, could everything... I, some people must sit in their living room, uh, or front room as we used to call it, for days thinking of how, what to call the YouTube channels, wouldn't they? To the yeah. loom and back, that's ace, is that? Uh, good everything from a rainy Stainforth and Keedby canal. We didn't do the Stainforth no, and Keedby. we didn't, did we? I think it's because it's got the word stain in it, innit? <laughs> is that why we didn't do it? Stain. I think it is. If I had to put that mop bucket down, there might have been some stains this morning. I ain't checked your pants yet. Oh, well, no, it's fine. Just chuck them straight in washer. Uh, Hi, Foxes from Bush Mills. We're not in Bush Mills. No, we're not, are we? Uh, <laughs> Alfie, can you cut and paste my face? Oh, I. Is that a euphemism? <laughs> and st it is, I'm sure. I've seen a website where they do that. Can you cut and paste my face and stick it on the screen? To replace Sean. Now, if I'd have known, I could have, I could have prepared that and probably done that, but unfortunately, uh, no. Uh, inquiry minds want to know, are you joining the circus? I know where that comes from. Uh, no, we're not joining the circus. I don't know where that comes from. Uh, people were saying about going to Botswana and going, and some, and then somebody said about joining the circus, and it was just like, yeah, why don't we join the circus? Uh, good job it wasn't on a spin cycle. Now this is where I start getting confused because we're way behind. We are, we are. Uh, right, so uh, be careful how you take this, but Fenella the Kettle, which is so wet, apparently. <laughs> she says, I'm so wet. Shall we just leave that there and not read the rest of it? Yeah. They'll read the rest <laughs> of it, poor woman. Fenella the Kettle, which says, I'm so wet, but happy. Shall we leave it there instead? <laughs> no, put it back on. Let's read it. She's wet poor and, woman. She's wet and happy. Oh. Hey. She's wet and happy. Uh, and wish she'd stopped at home. You can't be doing it outdoors, love. I bet it's on. I bet she's doing it on a train. Oh, uh, she's wet and happy on a train. Uh, wish we'd stopped at home, but when you're offered the chance of a free weekend in York, you don't turn it down. That's why no, she's wet. You don't. Because yeah, that's why she's wet. We've been to York a few times, and I can say, as nice a place as it is, it's never made me wet and happy. Is it you? <laughs> Somebody didn't like that. We got a thumbs down for that. Yeah, we got a thumbs down for that. Uh, here's another one you won't like then. Uh, 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 Roswood, a boyfriend many years ago, came round to my side of the bed, aimed at the bedroom wall and peed. I got the backlash in my face. Oh! I soon woke up. Oh! oh. You should have filmed it. There's, there's people on OnlyFans that pay for stuff like that, isn't there? Oh, yes, there is. Ugh! Not me, not me. Right, I'm, I'm going to scan it. Yeah, two people didn't like that one. I'm not surprised, love. Right, I'm going to scan down to the bottom because we're getting behind and we don't want to get behind. No, we don't. Uh, William Langsdorf, uh, super chat for $50. Woo Thank you so Thank much. You. Howdy from Kansas. Uh, glad to see... Oh, well done on winning the Super Bowl. Uh, glad to see Sean has come back to you. I know. Pete, what? some people genuinely thought... Can Kansas. Did Kansas win the Super Bowl? Kansas City Blues or something? Or isn't that a song? That is that what Blondie sang? No, it's Union City Blues, isn't it? Kansas City Blues. I know, I know. It's candy. I don't know. I didn't. I don't. I don't follow the Super Bowl. Uh, here's a little something for whatever is needed. I think a liver transplant today. <laughs> yeah. Is, 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 I think that might be a bit more than fifty dollars, though. Uh, enjoyed, <laughs> Thank you. Enjoyed you for years. A bit like you. You've enjoyed me for years, haven't you? And years. Uh, first and time years. watching a live chat. Uh, actually live instead of late. Well, there you go. Yay! It's a first for everything, and thank you so much for the super chat. 
Uh, it's Tauline like Pauline. Tauline like Pauline. I got it right. Oh, right. It's, it's not toweling like toweling, is it? All right, I'm, I'm coming to the bottom now. Not like... Just uh, Kansas City Chiefs. There you go. I was right, you see. Kansas City Chiefs. All right. Yeah. Uh, Andrew says, you boys need a further helper to keep an eye on the chat. Why? We don't, do we? No. I think we're doing all right, are we? Uh, Colin, what year were you were born? Uh, uh, it was in the 70s. That's it all I'm 19. saying. No, we're not saying what year. Why? Because people get my birthday and then the year and they can start applying for credit cards and stuff, can't they? So there's something a lady never reveals her tricks or her Birthday's age. on the calendar. Yeah, isn't it? But it doesn't say what year. No, it doesn't. Chris and Mary Downs. Hello. Oh, lovely people. As I was saying earlier before you rudely interrupted me, people thought that you were AI on that last vlog. Really? Yeah, and Did they that? also thought you were the milk tray man. Why? Because they were all in black. Because you were all in black. And as you walked in, you went, do, do, do. <laughs> no, I did not. You did. And you kind of whooshed away, <laughs> jumped out the window, <laughs> into the loch. Oh. You, could, you could be a milk tray delivery man. You'd eat them all before you got there. That's true, I would. Uh, Lazza, it's a long weekend here in British Columbia. Civic holiday. Wow. Uh, cheers to your family. Thank you. I uh, just got home, so ha, ha, she's off again with these bloody H's. I can't, why can't I do H's? You do that one. Just home, so hi from Ohio. Beth Oberly. That hi, Colin and Sean. Always look forward to your live chats. Oberly. Love you, Jen. That sounds like a posh name, doesn't it? Oberly. Oberly. It's very spaffing, isn't it? Spaff Spiff <laughs> spiffing, not s <laughs> I mean spiffing. <laughs> It's very spiffing. It's a posh name. Oh, some words he comes out with. Spiffing, spaffing. It's all the same, isn't it? Uh, the 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 yeah, that one wasn't nice. The 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 fake Sean wasn't as real, was it? Uh, Global Unit says I can re recommend a hepatologist for Sean's liver test. I thought a hepatologist dealt with like brown leaves on plants. That, it says it's in it. It's like it starts with a H and it's got an ologist in it. I'm sure it is. I'm sure it is. I'm going. I'm going to. I'm going to check that out. Hello, I'm late. I'm cooking dinner, but I'm listening in. Hope everyone is well and has had a good week. We have. Thanks, fans, well, for the memories. Uh, Suzanne, right? Sorry about that. Eight, eight abbreviated my last name here on the right. I have absolutely no idea what's going on. <laughs> Do you? No. Can you help me? It's not no me, idea is it? What that is. It's not me, is it? <laughs> it have really you is. been drinking as well? I think she's been drinking. Evening all. Kelvin, hello. Hello, Kelvin. By Ollie and Otis a bone. We um, shall. Kendall and Kevin, they came to see us. They did. We have we have a selfie with Kendall and Kevin at the bottom of our drive. Kendall. Uh, yeah, there is a Kelvin. Web... Kel yes, yeah, so that's what I said, didn't I, Kelvin? What did I say? Kendall. Yeah, Kelvin and Kendall. Look, Kurt Etner. Oh, sorry, yeah, it's because I was looking at the uh, just the Kelvin, I thought, yeah. Do I la la. It's all right, I'm just poorly. <laughs> President's <laughs> holiday in the US on Monday. President's holiday? Oh, Fiona Ross says, hi guys, I don't normally comment, but I just wanted to say hi. Hello, Fiona. Everybody say hello to Fiona. Hello, Fiona. Hello. Uh, Beth Oberly, sp spiffing, spaffing Oberly, says, uh, lol, my maiden name was McEwen. McEwen. Beth McEwen, that sounds like a lager, doesn't it? <laughs> is there a lager called McEwen? That's, no, I, I think there is. I think there is a McEwen's lager, and I think it's got a man who looks like... Uh, William Shakespeare that's like holding it. Am I, I don't, you, you're going to correct me, I don't mind because I want to know because she did really well finding out that Munter's name that we thought we fancied but we didn't last week. So you can help us out. I'm sure he is. He's got, he's got like feathers and he's holding a thing and he's got a big hat on and he's holding a pint and I'm sure that's McEwan's lager. Right, or I'm know. having some really weird dreams. It's one of them, I don't know. Uh, Chris Flynn's glad to see us back together again. It's been <laughs> awful, hasn't it? Uh, hello, Scotland Fact. When I was young, when I was young, that's a song, isn't it? When I was young, 
Uh, uh, like Stop, what, I don't wonderful. know what planet he's da, 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 da. on tonight. Oh, that's you can't do it. Slow down with that whiskey. Da, da, da. I'm trying to think of the song now. Ah, oh, it's, it's gone. It's gone. Uh, when I was young, uh, life seemed so wonderful. So something or something something. Don't you know it? You know it. You're making me. Th you're making me look like I'm like I'm deranged. Ranched. I'm not deranged. It's a song. I'm going to come back to that. Uh, my dad used to roll me down hills in big tyres. Oh, well, yes, I've done that when I were a kid. Well, that answers a few questions. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't it? <laughs> I think I might have been. I think I might have fallen out of my tyre. I think you would drop from the first floor window. <laughs> I think I fell out of my tyre a few times. Those were good years. Uh, isn't a hep hepato... Now, this is just spelt wrong. This is getting silly. Isn't a hep hepatologist... I know a few todgers. Isn't a hepatologist to do with vacuum cleaners? I need a whiskey. I give up. Oh, look who's on. Mr Fuller. Gary Fuller. Chips and gravy is all you need after a night out on the lash. Oh, I want chips and gravy now. I fancied something savoury all day and all I've eaten is chocolate. Chocolate? Uh, I had a yeah. turkey toasty, but chocolate. No hangover in the morning. Well, he didn't get up till this afternoon, so he didn't. He, <laughs> technically, he didn't have a hangover this morning, did he? Oh, you? Gary, you should have seen the state of me when I got up. <laughs> Ugh. I knew there was something wrong, because he got up... He you were up, already up, weren't you, with the dogs? I, I got up at half past six because I couldn't sleep because I was worried about her. And, her? Uh, yeah. And, uh, and and he kind of got up about quarter past half past eight. It took about 20 minutes to get downstairs, which is a good trick in a bungalow. Uh, <laughs> went to the toilet and then went back upstairs again and then shut the door and that was it. He didn't even, you didn't even come in and say, hello, good morning, I love you or anything. No, I weren't thinking, right, I, was just, I just thought, I need to go to Lou. And then I went back to bed. Yeah. I thought, oh, cheers. <laughs> anyway, I was straight on the phone to Lewis, so there you go. Oh, well, we're having chips and gravy tomorrow now. Chips and gravy. Right. Chips and gravy. Suzanne says, it's not me, I can't type. No, it's me, I can't type. I abbreviated my last name on you to be... To, to... Oh, my good God. Stop drinking. Speak French. <laughs> Hi, Fiona. Everybody's saying hello to Fiona now. Uh, Ian Lindsay says, what is the main colour of your wedding tartan so I can buy a new kilt to my... Well, oh, we can't tell you because it's a big secret. Yes. In fact, I think there was a, a, a there, there was a photograph of it in the vlog, wasn't there? Have you not seen it? There was a photograph with me in my wedding outfit in the Yes, I did vlog. see that, yes. You were sort of blanked out, wasn't it? I had the biggest sensor sticker over me that YouTube's ever put on me. And we're still peeling the sticky yeah, we're, off we're this morning. We're not revealing what we are wearing, unfortunately, Ian. But whichever kilt you have, I don't. Loads it doesn't of, matter. Loads of people are coming in kilts. So loads of people coming in kilts, and they'll be all colours. It's going to be different kilts, so <coughs> you're going to be able to wear whatever you want. Yes. Don't matter if you look a pillock, <laughs> but you'll be able to wear whatever you want. It'll be ace, won't it? I love that. That's <laughs> ace. <laughs> it doesn't do it when you want it to. It's only when you say certain words. Penis. Uh, what is the colour of your wedding tartan? We've done that one. Right, so, uh, hi Fiona. It's not doing it again. I'm clicking and it's not working. Hi Fiona and hi Fiona. Right, shall we... We, we need to talk about the wedding. Do we? I think a little bit. Yeah, let me just get uh, get rid of that. Uh, because we, we've got a little teaser for you. I thought I'd play them a little, a little preview of a video. Okay. That I think you're gonna like. I don't know anything about this. No, because he's been too. <laughs> all day too. <laughs> he, has to, he doesn't. He hasn't had a clue what's been going. I World haven't... War Three <laughs> could have broken out today, and he wouldn't have had a clue. <laughs> he would have just been. Oh, I need to readjust. He would have just been incinerated and, oh. and, and be happy. Right. I've not been happy today. I've got something to show you, and it's not me todger for a change. Oh. <laughs> uh, I'm going to play you a little clip, uh, and this is us driving up the driveway to our wedding venue, and we're still not going to tell you where it is. Now, some of you will work it out, because it is a very, very famous, familiar castle, 
and some of you will work it out. So all I ask, please, is don't, don't put, it on there. put it on the chat wall. Keep it to yourself, or you can say, I know, but no clues, nothing that you think is cryptic, because people will work it out. So if you know, you can say that you know, and you can put little smiley faces and winky faces and things like that. Uh, but don't say on the chat wall or give any clues to what it is. Are you ready? Here we go. Oh, this is us driving up to the wedding venue. I hope they remove that cone there. And here it is. There is our castle. No, don't fade there. Oh, oh it faded there. It faded there. Oh, shall we watch it again? Shall we watch it again? <laughs> this driveway is very long, and it? it's about a quarter, half a mile long. Yeah. It goes on forever and ever. And sorry it's raining, but there's the castle. There's our castle. Oh, it's faded again. They'll have worked it out now. Ah, well, I'm not bothered. Nah. Alistair Holes, good evening, Colin and Sean. What are you both drinking? Oh, you might be better going back to the beginning. But, and watching. Yeah, I'm on orange juice because I'm suffering. Mm. Uh, Nico's here. Hello, Nico. It just, I don't know what it is about that photo. It's scary, isn't it? It's like you don't want to look, but you just, every time yeah, you turn you just your head, stare. You, you feel drawn back to it, don't you? Oh, dear me. Yeah. Caroline, uh, hi, guys. Hope you're enjoying your weekend. We are. I've got a strong end, me. Uh, Super Tramp. Hey. Yes. It is, it's Super Tramp, that song, When I Was Young. Da, 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 oh, da, right, da, right, yeah. Da, da. Logical song, I think it is. I can hear, yes. I can hear uh, Sherlock. Uh, Peter Hunt, hello, evening chaps, having a wee dram, listening along to you both, glad you're doing well. I'm having a wee dram, but it's so diluted in lemonade because I'm just such a pussy when it comes to spirits. Yeah, you are, aren't you, really? You're not, you're not keen on spirits, are you? I've got a tooth that I need out. Good luck with that. Logical song everybody's saying. Super yes. Trump. Uh, Andrea Range, I'm a quiet, shy person too. Pigs flying. There is a lager named McEwen. We oh. used to import it here to America every year for St. Patrick's Day. We ah, also got right. a bottle of, of Jamison. Jamison, I don't know. Uh, Spudley, sorry we're late again. Does this mean detention or the cane? Both. Uh, they can borrow my paddle. Yes. My big paddle. Uh, Tony Good, that whiskey looks like pee. Well, I, I don't drink a lot of pee, so I wouldn't know what that looks like. No. But, but there you go. Uh, vacuum cleaner filtration. I think they're talking about hepta, hepta thingyologists now, aren't they? Uh, Tauline, that sounds like Pauline Rutherford. Hello. Hello. To go towards Sean's aspirin. I've had mine now. It's time for a nap. Yes, time for a nap. You could have done with some uh, aspirin earlier, couldn't you? I've had some brufen. 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 I brufen profen. I didn't look very posh the next morning, she says. <laughs> Alistair Hall says, any Freddos tonight? He's got none. He's got some caramel. Uh, no, I better cover the name up, didn't I? Because it's like product placement. But I've got some, I've got some caramel there, look. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> there it is. When I was young, when I was young, it seemed that life was so wonderful, a miracle. Oh, it was beautiful, magical. Told yes. you. Told you. Uh, Chris and Mary thinks it's a Doris Day song. Well, <laughs> wrong. <laughs> uh, Ken Haynes says a liver doctor is called a hepatologist. Hepatite. He hepata. We had a baked hepato, didn't we, for dinner? <laughs> With a bit of liver and onion on it. An ologist is someone who specialises in something. You're an ologist then, aren't you? Well, what do I specialise in, apart from, like, sex toys and stuff? It's, that's what you were going to say, wasn't it? Well, is there, like, a Latin name for sex toys, do you think? A toyologist. Vibratorologist. <laughs> oh. <coughs> How far behind are we? I don't know. I don't care. I'm enjoying this. Uh... My hubby, you're singing the logical song. Or is it her hubby is singing the logical I don't know. Look before you press enter. Camera one, camera two, camera one, camera two. It don't work like that, though, does it? No. Camera one, camera two, camera one, camera two. 
Uh, Nico's so excited. Why? I have absolutely. Why are you excited? N- no idea. Alfie knows because Alfie's coming. Yes, <laughs> he knows where it is because he's to the coming. wedding. To the wedding, he's coming to the wedding. It's not like so excited that he's just spiffing because that's posh. Yeah. Uh, Kim Eaton, can I come to your wedding? Never been to one, not even my own. Well, we we are releasing tickets, but we have to charge for them because it's costing so blooming much. Uh, that we have to. Ch- we'll, we'll, I'll explain it. I think I've got the slides this this time. Have you got the slides this time? Yeah, we'll explain deleted. it then. We'll explain it. Let me just play the video again while I get my slides ready, because uh, they'll all be on Google Earth now. Yes. Try, trying to get street view, and you can't get street view on this because it's not a street; it's a private track. Oh, it's going to fade away. Oh, there he goes. Uh, so right, yeah. Uh, most of you know this, but we are releasing tickets for some of you to come to the wedding. Most of the people that are coming are, are, are close friends and family. But we're releasing a few tickets for people, and we're releasing like a couple every couple of weeks because we know people are trying to save up or waiting while payday or whatever. Uh, so we're releasing a couple of weeks. We'll release... Shall we release two pairs tonight? Yes. We'll release two <laughs> pairs tonight. So there's three types of tickets of invitations so the first one is what we call package one now we've got a shift for this so package one is where you basically come for the whole day so you'll arrive between about 10 and 11 o'clock in the morning uh, at the venue now we're not publicly saying where the venue is for those that have not worked it out yet but it is in the highlands of scotland and it's about half an hour away from inverness so you'd need to make your own way to inverness now, you can either drive to the venue, there's car parking there, or if you're staying in Inverness, we're laying a bus on from Inverness that will take you to the castle. It'll get you there about half past ten in the morning. And it'll take you back again at midnight. Yeah, so you get all day, <coughs> 13, 14 hours. With you. <coughs> so, package one, you get email updates between now and the wedding on all the plans, what's going on. You get that return transport from Inverness to the castle and back. Uh, you'll get some drinks when you arrive. You get access to the castle. Uh, All the gardens and the ground, just like hundreds of acres of it. Uh, You'll be able to take away an order of service uh, and a menu card and your seating card home with you as a little souvenir. Uh, Gents, you'll get buttonholes and ladies will get... Corsets. 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 I can't say it. That'll weigh the dresses down. Cortege. Corsages. Corsage. Yeah, something like, yeah. Corsages. You'll get seats at the wedding ceremony. You'll get drinks to toast us. Uh, You'll get the three-course wedding breakfast uh, plus wine plus the toasting drinks. Uh, You get to choose your menu. Uh, You get the evening entertainment uh, with some supper. You get to meet and mingle with us and all the guests and his family and friends and the other followers and some boat tubers. Uh, You'll be in all the photographs. So you get on the wedding album and you'll get access to that wedding album online. You'll also get a digital copy of the wedding video. We're not vlogging it. We're having a professional videographer yes. team coming in. And, and they... you will get a physical copy of the wedding photos as well, won't they? Yeah, well, it'll be a photo book. A photo book. Yeah, uh, with a selection of the best ones. But you'll get the whole, the whole gallery online. Uh, you'll be able to take a slice of the, of the wedding cake away with you. Uh, and, and like Sean says, you'll get a, sli- a sliced copy of the photo book. A sliced copy. A signed copy of the photo book. <laughs> yes. Uh, now, it's costing a hell of a lot to put this wedding on, which is why we're having to charge for these tickets. Uh, so the, the prices, the details are there. Uh, I'll show. I'll give you the link on if you want more, more details on that. So that's like the whole day thing. Now, if you don't want to come for the whole day, we've got just like the evening package. So you get basically the same stuff, just not the service. Uh, so you have to make your own way to and from the venue, uh, but you'll get uh, welcome drinks, you'll get access to the castle and the grounds, the order of service cards, the entertainment, the supper, the meeting, the photographs, the gallery, everything. It's just from late afternoon rather than all day. Yeah, from about five o'clock, isn't and it? That's a little bit cheaper. Uh, <laughs> and then package three is called the guests from afar. This is a, I think this is going to be a really popular package. This is for people who kind of want the, the experience and want to see everything that's going on, but can't make it over to Scotland. So this, you still get the email updates on all the plans and preparations. Uh, We'll send you out, wherever you are in the world, an order of service and some menu souvenir cards from the castle, from the day. So you'll actually get them from the castle. Yes. You'll still get online access to the wedding photo gallery and a digital copy of the wedding video. And you'll also get a signed photo book from the wedding day sent out, posted out to you as well. Uh, That is the cheapest option. 
but that's what you get for that. If you want details on any of them, uh, you can just go to our website, which is foxesafloat.com, and then just click on shop. And it's down there. We've also got some QR codes. Uh, so for package one and two, uh, you can click that one. Uh, and for package three, uh, you can click the other one that's just below it. Let's just move that a little bit so you can see them. God, I'm knackered now. That was a right chore. It was a right chore, wasn't it? <laughs> right. Julian's so got it. While you're looking, I'm just going to read some of these comments uh, while you're looking at that. It's not a safari park. Uh, says Kim. Uh, Joe Brown looks amazing. Uh, Michelle says it's the cafe at New Miller Dam. Paul Ainge says, I know, yeah, because you're coming. <laughs> yes. Oh. Uh, Thomas, he's, Can... co he's coming, so he says the lane to the venue is enchanting, cannot wait. It's going to be even better in August because all the leaves will, will be on the trees and everything. The grass will be green. Uh, Phil says it looks stunning. Esther can't wait. Uh, Sandra says lips are sealed. <laughs> Chris Sandra Flynn. Hughes. Chris Flynn knows. Uh, Coffee Spurs says the trees, trees on the dot drive will look cool in the summer. Uh, not Disneyland Castle, says Goldie. Alfie says looks ace. Uh, wedding will be amazing at the castle. It is going to be amazing. Uh, well, I know it's not my family's castle, says Sean Graham. <laughs> uh, let's have a look. I'm, we're so behind. I'm just trying to make sure nobody's spoiled it. Yeah. I don't think nobody's. I don't think anybody's spoiled it. Ah, uh, dear. Can I write... Bah, 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 bah. Lindsay clan. They've got their own clan. Tom Simpson. I can't wait to get a personal photo with Sean and Colin. It's just what I've always wanted. But another one? <laughs> <laughs> you must have about 100. Just go on Facebook. Uh, no, he's, he's got them on his um, coasters. <laughs> got our faces on his coasters. Funny faces. <laughs> Uh, Sue Bates says, is it Camelot? Camelot. Right, I'm going to take these QR codes off because I don't just want to go on about that all night. Uh, but uh, that, that that's the details. If you want more details, just go to our website. It's foxesafloat.com yeah. and then just click the shop tab in the top uh, in the top menu and, and the details for those packages are in there. Or you can email us uh, if you want more details. If you've got any questions or anything like that, uh, email address is just down at the bottom. I'll leave that on for a few seconds. Uh, so the wedding is... Uh, we've got to be a bit careful because this is not a joke. People are phoning wedding venues around the Highlands asking if we are there and what date. People are trying to find out and I think that's a bit weird. It's a bit stalky, strange. <laughs> Stop that. That's just <clears throat> weird. You strange, insane people. Do you know how insane it is? We've actually been advised to hire a couple of security staff. This is not a joke. And we're going to have security staff on the, at the gate at the gate of the castle and inside the castle uh, because people are trying to find out and they want to just turn up. So Not happening. 99.9% of you are lovely, but that's the, right. That's 0.1% yes. that's planning on just turning up. Don't because it's not a in. long way to come to be thrown to be out turned again. away. Uh, it is a very famous castle for those of you who haven't worked it out yet. Uh, I can't tell you. Otherwise, I would be a traitor, wouldn't I? <gasps> I would be a traitor. But there you go. Yes, very sick people do that. Right, I'm going to get rid of that email address now. Uh, there you go. Let's get back to the chat. Is it going to be a super formal affair? It is. Well, it isn't. It isn't. We want, we're want. we asking guests to be smartly dressed. Yes. But it's not like tuxedos and bow ties and things like that. No, it's not. No, if no, no a, not that posh. If you're a bloke, just trousers, shirt and tie. Or maybe, a kilt, a, whatever. Maybe a jacket or a kilt if you want to. As some people are, some people aren't. Yeah. Mainly the Scottish guests are wearing kilts, aren't they? Yeah. Uh, Andrea and Michelle are the security. You, you are. You, you do. We haven't told you yet, but you are. <laughs> Nobody would want to pass you to. That's how you're paying for your room. Is you're working it, baby. You're working it. Uh, Loopy Lou says, "I think security is very wise. A lot of nutters." Uh, Kelvin, we're so looking forward to it. Blows our mind. Uh, we are really not rock stars. No, Honestly, we Whoa, are not. Far from it. We are not. Uh, Hobshire, <laughs> I was waiting for this one. Do you have a new office chair? <laughs> yes. Yes, I, I do have a new office chair. Uh, 
long story as short as I can make it. I've been having shortest story is it's a waste of money. <laughs> I've no, it's not because they're fixing it. They're sending a new one. No, I meant for the reasons. Oh no, it's working. It's it's having an effect. Is it having an yeah. effect? Uh, I, I, I've basically got a condition where the long story short, the tendon right at the bottom of my abdominal muscles at the top of my leg is 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 shot, and I'm in a lot of pain in my groin, and it's really it's where your appendix is. So imagine there. And every time I do anything, it literally hurts for two or three days. Uh, and again, as as you know, the the bother I have with health around here, you know, like four months for a kidney stone that wasn't all in my head. Uh, I've had this for two years, and it's taken two years to get nowhere. So I, I went to see a private physiotherapist. And um, bingo. Yes, uh, day before yesterday yeah. on Thursday. Thursday. Uh, and within an hour, he knew where it was and working on it now, and it's getting better already after two years. Uh, so part of the, the thing was my old office chair was causing me a lot of grief. Uh, so so I got a new office chair, which is it's better a lot, posture. It's better posture, basically, because I'm in here a lot. So uh, so that's where it is. That wasn't a very short story, was it? No. Uh, it's not Balmoral Castle. No, that's definitely not Balmoral Castle. Uh, it is a whole lot of weird. Uh, Francis, can we come to your wedding? Yep, all the details we just told you about. Go to foxesafloat.com and click on shop and all the information on the packages. Uh, are there. Uh, James, there's some weird people on YouTube. Yeah. Why would they do we're that? We're included. <laughs> we we're we're we part are. of them. We are. Just remind, while we're talking about YouTube, I was, uh, while Sean was sleeping off his hangover this morning, I was answering some YouTube comments on yesterday's vlog and uh, a, a vlog from Tailors aboard came up. Do you remember? All oh, right, yes. They're, now, that, they're yeah. now called Tailors aboard a narrowboat. Uh, Are they? Yeah, and and I started watching it, and it was like wow. And Josh, who who does all he does all the filming and editing, yeah, he's and, pretty and good. And he does a lot of, of a lot of vlogs. And you, I don't. They've got like five and a half thousand subscribers, something like that. And it's like you look at the vlogs, and he's 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 got an eye for like camera work similar to me. Yeah. And and I was watching how he, how he was like the, all the shots and everything, and it's so similar to how I used to do it. And he's he's got talent. Yeah, he's, and then he, he starts has. and then he starts talking, and he's just got this voice. It's just so smooth and relaxing. And I they, they should have like a hundred times more subscribers because I don't mean this in a bad way, but you look at some of the canal boat tubers, and most of them are really good yeah. and original. Yeah. Uh, and there's a couple of kind of plastic fake ones. You know what I mean. Yeah, but like Josh is just brilliant and he's unique. He is good. So uh, if if you if you looking for a new narrowboat and he's different, I tell you what the fact because it's him and his mum and his dad uh, and and they've got some pets and they are very down to earth. So ex yes. expect real real kind of real life stuff and, and, and gritty themes sometimes. But I tell you what, we met them a couple of times and they are the nicest most genuine down-to-earth people brilliant family uh, so get, get, go on youtube and give them subscribe to them and, and tell them that we've sent you it's called taylor's aboard a narrowboat so taylor's t-a-y-l-o-r-s taylor's aboard a narrowboat uh, give them a follow tell them that i've sent you you my belly i can hear your belly is that all them chicken pakoras yes <laughs> Uh, well, I f sorry, I've forgotten where we were. I, I, I keep getting carried away. Right, so uh, we were James, weren't we? Uh, right, Noddy Brown says, I'm about four hours away from you and would like to come, but I get too anxious. Well, there's, yes. no, there's no need to. We are putting a table right at the back next to the door for the anxious people yes. who can come in and out. So that you can just walk outside if you get a bit too anxious. So not only are you on the kind of periphery, so there's nobody sat around you. You're basically, there's nobody around you. And you're on a quieter table where you're not all bunched up together. So it's nice and chilled, nobody around you, and it's right next to the door. So if you need to go out and get some air, nobody's going to know because everybody's sat in front of you. I thought, I thought, and I was thinking of me when I thought of that. Yeah. So I'm going to be sat on that table as well. You're going to have to shout <laughs> your I vows. Am I on the top table on my own? Yeah, then? you're going to have to shout your vows from across the other end of the hall. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, what's in Colin's oh. bin? Alistair. Alistair. Oh, we need a jingle for this, don't we? What's in? I can, I can see what's in there now. What's in Colin's bin? We need a jingle, don't we? We do. You have to make one. Right. I have no idea. We're gonna have to. We're gonna have to make a jingle, aren't we? We're gonna have to make a jingle. Colin's. What's in Colin's bin? It's becoming quite a feature, isn't it? Uh, right. So. 
<laughs> so, that's that's basically two thirds of my Adidas sliders. You can see all the bite marks, can't you? Where they've had they've had a go. This is Ollie. This is mainly Ollie. But that that there's about a third of it missing, where he he basically chews it when I forget and I just leave it. You can actually see the bite marks. So you can see his teeth marks. Bless him. Uh, so yeah, a slider. We could through more flip flops. Uh, some quite stiff kitchen roll. You probably don't want to know what's from that. Uh, half a chocolate bar wrapper. 15% uh, off a Uber Kinky. Uber Kinky? <laughs> yeah. Uh, a plastic poo. <laughs> I don't know why the plastic poo is in there. Uh, what else we got? Don't uh, throw that plastic poo away. It's off a game, isn't it? Some more. More things. Uh, a rubber glove. A rubber glove with a finger missing out of the. <laughs> it's what he wears when he's feeding Sherlock, <coughs> picking up Sherlock's food so he doesn't contaminate his hands. Feeding Sherlock. <laughs> Give up. That's what St. Colin's been this week. Yeah, don't throw that plastic poo away. It's on, it's, it belongs to a game. I think I took it off Otis. Oh, and in fact, you? Tom got us that game, didn't Tom he? Tom got us it, yeah, so don't throw us it. Don't it looks it like Mr. Hanky the Christmas poo, doesn't it? Yeah. I'm going to put this down here because I can't, I'm not reaching back there because I'll hurt myself. We, defini we definitely need a jingle, don't we? Yeah, for you're what St. Colin's to, been. Like, get on it now. Yeah. yeah. I think I think I think we're going to have to do uh, sixty degrees north. Says I've got one of those chair and it soothes his piles. Oh, oh I ain't got piles. <laughs> I ain't got piles. Uh, what not to do? Says good evening, guys. Great to see you again. Hugs from Ullapool. Ullapool up I, north. Rather strange to see Sean with orange. <laughs> My, yes. It must have been one hell of a night last night. It was. Uh, our honey has run out. Oh, we'll have some in uh, late spring. Well, I'll tell you what, I think we're going to get a lot of honey this year. I think so, yes. Because we're going to be busy. Last year, I started the year with three hives and ended it with 21. Now, the thing is, all most, well, all but three of the hives were kind of starting from scratch. So they had to build all their own comb, apart from like five frames, and then they had to fill it all with honey. Now this year, all the combs already done, and I went to see them about a week ago. I put something on social media, and they've still got loads of stores. I know there's quite a bit. There could be quite a bit of winter left yet. It could yeah. only be a month or so. Yeah. But it could be a couple of months. I mean, it snowed in June last year, didn't it? Uh, did it? Or hail or something. Yeah, or something, something, yeah it was hail. Uh, but yeah, there's there's still a long way to go. But they're all. Every single hive is still going really strong. I had a tiny little peak when it was warm and sunny and no wind the other day, and every single hive is is really still packed. And they've got lots of stores. All the hives are nice and heavy. And they came out foraging for that day, didn't they? Yeah. So I've got a feeling we're going to get a lot of honey this year. So fingers crossed for that. We might get two harvests. We might get a spring summer one and then the uh, heather honey again. Uh, in, in yeah. September. Yeah, th the first harvest will be wildflower, won't it? Tabarnit! Ted, thank you for the super chat. <laughs> Tabarnit! <laughs> thank you. Hello. Cheers, Ted. Hello to you. Right, I've, oh, I've got, I keep falling behind because I start rabbiting on about stuff, don't I? Yeah. Uh, Steve Fisher says, I came down from Inverness to London today and headed back up tomorrow and had to make a decision, a night in the flesh pots of Soho or an evening in a hotel room watching us. We won. I we won. I think so. I should think so. You I don't want to be going into funny Soho bars. Mm. <laughs> uh, Coffee Spurs says, I can't imagine the annoyance of your health being in your head. It's not. No. It never is. Every time I've been for the last two years... With, it's in your head, Colin. It's in my head, and it, it hasn't been. So, yeah, there you go. Uh, there's some weird people on YouTube. We know. Followed by the comment, what's in Sean's bin? What's in Colin's bin? Come on, love, get it right. <laughs> it's not difficult. Colin's studio. Yeah. Colin's bin. The jingle, what's in Colin's bin? Yeah. You've been making a jingle now, haven't you? If you want to sing my new jingle, let me know. And I'll put lots of, I nearly said flowers, uh, f like whistles and bangs and stuff to it. I've got a man who does that for me. Right. Uh, 
Paul McManus says it's morning here at 11.45 a.m. Wow. I don't want it to be morning again. I've had enough of today. Yeah. I mean, I'm ready for bed, actually. I want to go to bed. Uh, Cameron says, I can't make the wedding, but I'm very happy for you and those who can attend. Wishing you the best weather. Well, it, it doesn't matter if it rains, because we'll it's be the inside. highlands. So if it rains, quarter of an hour later, it'll be all right. Then yes, it might be it. a bit windy. Then it'll snow. Then it'll be sunny again. So uh, there you go. Uh, the Taylors are sweet people, says Spice Yes, they are. They are. Uh, Loopy Lou, what's the name of that channel? It's called, I'm going to write it on the on the chat wall. It's called Taylors Aboard a Narrow Boat. You see, I can write on this chat wall as well. There you go. People didn't know I could do that, did they? Right, I'm going to scroll down a little bit because I'm falling behind and I don't want to fall behind a bit. Uh, Laurie's recovering from knee replacement surgery. You Ooh, want you want that? I'll don't be you? having that soon. Am I safe? Probably to start about having five some... years, I think. Can I have I some chocolate? Yeah, of course you can have some chocolate. Hey. Yeah, it means I think I'm going to be heading stop. down that way. I think in a few years' time, aren't I? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oops! <laughs> I can't do anything. You've got the mouse. I don't want people to see brown in my mouth. Oh. Bees are amazing creatures. They certainly are, Loopy Lou. They are. Benjamin, who? Rapost? Rapost? Please watch your health, Sean. Oh, that's, that's gone out the window. Shaky the gent. We all want to know what's in Sean's drawers. <laughs> no, you don't. Oh, it's my cousin Sue, look. I'll sing for you. <laughs> Are you going to sing the jingle then? Oh, God help us. <laughs> Mitch Walker, uh, sitting here in the southern US, or southern us. <laughs> US of A. Oh, US of A. Yeah, us of A. Yeah. Oh. Having a cup of coffee watching <coughs> you. You two. ate. You ate too. You ate to. Are your fingers not working, Mitch? They're mashing the keyboard. They're like Homer Simpson, <laughs> aren't they? When he put all that weight on and he's mashing the keypad. You need a dialing wand. <laughs> I'll sing what's in Colin's bit. Everybody wants to sing what's in Colin's bit. Oh, send them in. Send them all in and I'll put them together and it'll sound like a choir. Yeah, it will. Well, I'll put a little bit of reverb on it. What's in Colin's bin? Uh, have you thought of changing the name of the channel name? Now, now you're not uh, Noah Flo. Okay. <clears throat> we go through this every uh, week. Do, 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 do. She probably hasn't seen us answer that question the oh. other 18,000 times. So, <sighs> right. For you and for all the other, no, for you and everybody else, a float comes from keeping our head above water, i.e. mental health issues and surviving and living off grid and things like that. So because we lived on a boat, does that's not why we were called a float. So we are both called Fox, our surname. So we are the Foxes and we keep our heads afloat. We survive, which is what we do in Scotland up on the Croft. So I am absolutely i'm not going to rant like i did last time because i ended up editing that out but no we will we won't be changing our name <laughs> you're a lovely person and we <laughs> appreciate your comments and your feedback and your suggestions i think i handled that quite well the therapy's working in it therapy's working i'll tell you what oh my my feet are going like mad. I'm absolutely <laughs> fucking seething. <laughs> but I'm not going to show it. I'm going to be lovely and sweet. Oh, there you go. Dear. Don't forget your muff if you're eating. Oh, I don't get I, I don't get brown on my muff, do I? No. I'm 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 quite careful with with food in my office. Uh, uh, right, the McEwen's Liger man is dressed in a musketeer type costume with a big black wig. I said it was something like that, yeah, didn't you I? Did, yeah. I just mixed him up with William Shakespeare. Uh, hi, last week I mentioned about having your wedding rings made out of Scottish gold. Have you considered it? 
Well, we haven't actually looked into that yet. We haven't, no. Because we're kind of debating whether to actually get new rings or not, because... I think we should. He thinks we should. Well, you just said that, didn't you? But I think it's like bad luck. Cause no, the, it's not. These are... Well, let me finish. Okay. Right. I've had this ring for like, I don't know, 30 years? Yeah. And you've had that ring, yeah? So if we change rings now, it might be unlucky. I don't, I don't believe in that. I, I don't know. I, think, I don't believe I don't in know. all that I, rubbish. I, I Superstitious I rubbish. Know. I don't know. I'm quite happy with my ring the way it is. <laughs> Dave Green, why is that funny? Carry on. Dave Greenwood, go on, you do one. I'm having Good evening, chocolate. Colin, Sean, and all the animals from the Isle of Wight. The, the animals are not from the Isle of Wight. <laughs> oh my God, I'm so jealous of your wedding venue. Well, you can come along if you want. You know how to do it. Mm. Shaky the gent. Sean, you laugh. Your laugh is pure. You've missed a letter. Your laugh is pure awesome. Thank you. Jennifer Sherwood. Evening, gents. Great to see you both. <laughs> Sorry. What are you doing? I noticed something on there. Maggie Samuels is recovering from a hip replacement. Ooh. She fell and braked her hip. Oh, nasty. Got an itch on my nose. Lee Ray says, have you... Okay, hello, guys. Have yous ever, ever thought about life after foxes afloat and how long you guys are going to be on YouTube? Hopefully you guys will keep doing what you're doing for a long time. We do. Well, we? Watch this week's vlog, because that's what we talk about. Yes, yesterday's vlog. And I actually say, I am worried. Sorry, I'm just, I'm, I'm handling me poo. Uh, I like fidgeting with me poo, me plastic poo. Come it's on. Got... Oh, look, there's all water in it. Oh, that's gross. Uh, I've got water. In, what were I just saying about getting things in my muff as well? How has it got water in it? Because oh, you threw it in the bath. I threw it, I threw it in the bath, so Sean thought he'd pooed himself in the bath. And you did, didn't you? No. <laughs> uh, yeah, watch this week's vlog, because we actually say that we we don't care. We Well, it's not that we don't care, but we know YouTube is going to end one day. And one if, day. And if it ends, it ends. We do something else. So, But we're not we're not thinking about it, no. No, nah, we're not thinking about that. Uh, yeah. Mitch Walker says he has got fat fingers. You need a special dialing wand. <laughs> uh, Spudley says you only used to have one drone. Now you've got thousands. Yeah. <laughs> not at the moment. No, because they're all dead at the moment. Yes, all the drones will be... Uh, they kick them out. Yeah. Uh, come through the door. Let's explore in the thing. Oh, it's too complicated. I just think what's in Colin's bin, because it rhymes, doesn't it? It does. Hopefully all of us are afloat, says Dorothy. That's exactly right. Correct. Uh, go on, one for you. Uh, Andrea, uh, me and Michelle have got hairdressers booked, so all's good. Well, uh, we know. What do you mean, me and Michelle? Ah, Michelle did it. Whenever you talk, the microphone just goes wang. She just asked you if you wanted it doing. Are you gonna? Are you gonna give up? <laughs> uh, Russell Bickford says, "Have you signed up at any wedding registry at stores?" No, because we don't need anything. Nope. We're doing like we're, we're doing our romantic life backwards. Yeah. So instead of getting married and having a life together, we've had a life together, and now we're going to get married. So, we? But we we have got something in place, haven't we? So right, so yeah, we no, we've not got a wedding registry because we've already got a house, so we've got all the things that newlyweds generally want. Uh, so we haven't got that. We have got what we're doing instead is if anybody wants to kind of get us anything for the wedding, we've got a, a wedding registry with PayPal. Let me just move that. Uh, so it's PayPal.me forward slash Foxes Afloat. You don't have to have a PayPal account because we get people saying, "Oh, I don't want to do that because I don't want, I don't like PayPal." Uh, it's it's just a, the processor. You can pay by credit, debit card, or anything else. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, if you want to get us out for the wedding, uh, that's what we're doing. We've set up a, a, like a, a registry with PayPal, and you can just kind of donate what you would pay for a toaster or a wine glass yeah. or whatever. Or you could use the guest from afar. Or you can use the guest from afar package, uh, and and that helps to go and pay towards the wedding. And, and you'll get something back and some bits and pieces. You certainly will. So there you go. That answers that one. 
Uh, oh, we also have, just going back to that, uh, if you want to do that, by the way, uh, just paypal.me forward slash Foxes of Flow. Uh, we have also, we have got a, a, an Amazon wish list, uh, which is there. Uh, so if you want to get us out from our Amazon wish list, there's lots of little bits and pieces, uh, stuff from like one quid up to, I think, Lego Atats on there at the moment. I think oh. that's the most expensive thing. What's that? HTTPS. That's the uh, that's the website address. But oh, people normally just scan the QR code. Yeah. But there's little bits for us, and there's little bits that we could do with the house, and for the croft, and for the bees, and for yeah. Otis and Ollie. The chickens. And the chickens. There's all sorts on there. Uh, so so have a look at that if you want. I don't know what Claudia's laughing at. I hope she's not laughing at me. I hope she's not laughing at me. I'm going to move that up there a little bit because Sharon Bamba wants to say, well done for keeping your cool. <laughs> My leg was twitching. My leg was proper twitching. Oh, dear. Feisty when she says everyone's tuning in to find out what's in Colin's bin. Yeah, we've done it. I like the name Foxes. We like the name Foxes of Flow. Mm. We're not changing it. Uh, Colin's been to the tune of Blankety Blank. <laughs> Uh, just add add to the rings as you add to your joy. I get a lot of joy from my ring, do you? Well, I like twirling it. I'm actually, I've got a ratchet ring coming, like a like fidgety thing. What? Nothing. I, your belly? Can you hear his belly? Well, it's really rumbling. Uh, me, I've got like a ratchet ring, so I started with my Rubik's Cube. If you look on YouTube or, or Twitter and Facebook, I put a little short on there. Have you seen it? Yeah, yet? I've seen it, yes. i got a Rubik's Cube. I'm going to take Amazon off now. Uh, i got a Rubik's Cube. I got this like three days ago, was it? Yeah. Well, I started with it. I got it about a week ago, but I, I, I unboxed it about three days ago and started learning how to solve it. And it's like, you would not believe excuse me, how complicated it is. There's like eight steps and each step has got like 20 moves to it that you've got to, like your sequences that you've got to remember. And I was like, I can't be doing this. But then I had a bit of a bad week, didn't I? Yes. And I thought, I'm just going to sit down and I'm just going to focus on it and take my mind off things and, and started learning it. And then today I was just like... <laughs> just under sure. three minutes. <laughs> under three minutes I got it done in. So there you go. I would do it, but you can't talk for three minutes without me, so I'm not going to do it. Uh, but yeah, Rings of Joy, Rhodes, brilliant. Uh, Sue says, Sue's with me on the rings. Shh. Uh, Gary says, Colin, is your ring bigger than Sean's? Ask him for a friend. I don't know, let's have a look. I can't get I think your, your, I think your, your fingers are a little bit chunkier than mine. Yeah, they, they are. Yeah. I can't even get it off. Yeah. Sean's is definitely tighter. In it. Well, I put weight on. <laughs> I think mine's tighter, actually. Yeah. Uh, I. <laughs> there you go, Gary. <laughs> uh, hi, Colin and Sean. Do you have to have your bands read again? No. What does that mean? Your bands. It's B A N D S. It's yeah. It's what they do with the registrar and all that sort of thing. Ah, and, right. Yeah, okay. We don't have to do that again. I think, Al I think Alf is drunk, and I think <laughs> Alistair's encouraging him. <laughs> uh, rather than getting new wedding rings, you could get a kind of eternity ring. Well, that's what a wedding ring is like for a wedding, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, get a new ring and wear it on a different finger. No, I think, like, bloody hell, your stomach. Are you all right? Yeah. Do you feel all right? Yeah. Oh, that's going to be a right fat. I'm glad you're in spare room tonight. Oh, a dirt fart. That is going to be a right... <laughs> dirt fart. It's going to be a right fart, isn't it? Uh, you could have some Scottish gold smelted into your rings so you could get the best of both worlds. Smelted. I don't like that word, smelted. Do you? Why? Because it's it's like smelted. It's I think it's because it's, it's, it's got smell in it. You've got absolutely, like... Like, my head is like, whee, and yours is just like, <laughs> it's like what? <laughs> you know what I mean? I like try and see the thing in everything. See the thing in everything? Yeah, like the, the, the imagination, like stuff. It's still 12. I, I, I don't care. I, I, I'd never, ever plan to, to grow up. Oh, dear. 
Uh, right, somebody's saying that we froze. I've, I don't know. I don't know if we've frozen or not. So if we if if we have froze, you'll all start telling us. No, oh, don't miss that one up there. Uh, but if if we haven't froze, tell us we haven't froze. Uh, hello, Sue and Kev. Oh, we've got to behave now. Oh, we've got to behave. How many sleeps is it, Sue? We're going. To, me and Sue are going to see Abba. I'm going to see Abba again. I'm going with with Sue from Bickerstaff. Sue, Kev, Sue. You'll be making other Sue cry now. I know. But she's she's she goes to Spain. I thought she must be in Spain now. Mm -hmm. Our Sue. Mm -hmm. Hey, gorgeous. <laughs> I'm talking to Kev, not Sue. <laughs> Told Sean what wedding present you're getting. What? I hope it's parking. Parking, yeah. Oh, Andrea bakes the most amazing parking. Mm. Hi, guys. This is Kelly McCurdy. <clears throat> Excuse me, I had to burp. Hi, guys. Six inches of snow here in southwestern Pennsylvania. Can't wait for spring. Because <laughs> you think I'd have read that out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Shell Atkinson, who was Dobson and who was Fox when you combined your name? Well, it's a funny story, that, because both our surnames were actually Dobson Fox, weren't they? No. <laughs> <laughs> He's Dobson, I'm Fox, and we're both now Dobson Fox. We are, yeah. Sean's belly <laughs> sounded like a howling wolf. It's really going you for it, actually, isn't it? You can actually hear it. Uh, Gary Broadbent, I learned to do the cube in the 80s, can still do it in about 90 seconds. Wow. Wow. That's brilliant. I've always wanted to meet a man with hands that fast. <laughs> <laughs> what? He's more of a point of sisters, aren't you? Point of a, just, sisters? Yeah. What's that? A man with a slow hand. <laughs> <laughs> and an easy touch. Oh, dear. Uh, Kaz Jake says, uh, is it Jake's or Jack's? Uh, I know a Jake's. I'm not going to say that because it's a security thing, isn't it? Uh, Colin, you blew me a kiss last week. That's all I blew. Uh, I now want one from the love of your life. Oh, fine. <laughs> Have we done that there? Which one? That there. Super chat. Yes, I'm just about to do it. Hedda Jean, hello. So hello. enjoying this live stream while eating chocolate in the bath. Oh. I once did that. <laughs> he dropped it in the bath. And I dropped it and it proper looked like I'd shat in the bath, didn't it? Well, you put it on the side, didn't you? And it melted on the side. Yeah, it, it melted on the side. So it looked like I'd sat on the side of the bath and taken a shit and then slid back in again. <laughs> Oh, God. And because chocolate's like a bit oily, greasy, it doesn't kind of just wash away. It just gets kind of smeared in there. And it proper looked like a pooed. <laughs> I hadn't. Honestly, I don't do that, do I? No, I don't. do wee in bath sometimes if I know he's getting in after me, but that's about it. Uh, Alfie Barlow. <laughs> yeah, me, I'm with you on that one, mate. Gets too stressed with the Rubik's Cube. I have not got the patience for it. Uh, professional cubers, uh, here we go now. People tell it, it's going it's to turn into a competition where so and so has completed it four seconds before I've even started. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> where is that? The professional cubers, I didn't know they were professional cubers, yeah, have, have, have oil they use for faster action. So have I. That's what I could do with it, can I? I could lube my cube. Oh, yeah, that's a vlog title waiting to happen. Collins lubed his cube, isn't it? Oh, come on. Got a dislike for that. <laughs> you don't like that. You don't like that. Ah, I love it. Oh, brilliant. What's my super chat visible? Oh, dear, let's have a look. We might have missed some. Uh... There we go. Here we are. Sorry, Yay! James. Woo! For whatever you need. Oh, yeah, we did, because we said it was for Sean's new liver, didn't we? Or was that another one for whatever you Oh, that you one, need? another one. That weren't We're James's. All oh, right. Yeah, we must have missed that one then. Oh, sorry about that. You know we'd never miss you on purpose. Not on purpose. So it does look like I've got a jerky hand movement. I'm moving my mouse. I'm moving the comments back down to the bottom again. 
Uh, well, not not the bottom. Let's have a look. All oh, right, we haven't froze, which is good. Uh, Colin, like, it's like Peter Pan, never grow up. Yeah. There's, there's actually a story there. Can I tell this story? If you want. It's quite short, and I'm actually going to... No, quite I'm, short. You, you don't know what short is. You just babble and waffle. I'm going to change the names slightly, just so that Jonathan Birch doesn't get identified. Jonathan Birch! So when I was a kid, uh, there was... Uh, I used to knock around with a lad that lived a few doors up from me, and let's call him uh, Jonathan Turch. Uh, and and he's, he was a right laugh, and we used to have a, a, lot, a lot of laughs together, and we used to play out on his bikes and play Superman and trains and everything. Uh, and his mum didn't like me. And his mum once uh, said, when I knocked on the door, said, you can't play with Jonathan anymore because you will never grow up. She actually said that Did to you? me, yeah. And I rode my bike home, and I was really upset. And then as the years went by, I kind of thought, screw you, you were absolutely right. Well yeah. done. You were absolutely right. She's, <laughs> de uh, she's dead now, but there you go. Uh, one who smelt it, dealt it. Well, that's as de deltered it. That's a train, isn't it? Growing up is overrated. It is. Didn't freeze. You are not frozen. Not frozen. Angela's late to the party. Ooh. Oh, no, she's late to the fray. Same thing. Is it some doggers do? I think so. Oh, I thought so. I thought. <laughs> uh, now you've frozen. I don't. I don't know what's going on. Well, if we do freeze, it's going to be your connection. Yeah, because yeah, it could have been a Wi-Fi, says Sandy. Yeah, nobody else is saying that, so I don't know. Uh, I think we missed a super chat. Spudley. There we go, Spudley. Hello. For Andrew's liver salts. I thought, I was just going to say, who's Andrew? Who's For Andrew's Andrew? liver. I didn't see salts on the other line. What do what do liver salts do? They're supposed to settle your stomach. It's going to take more than that, isn't it? Yeah, they're supposed to settle your stomach. It's going to take more than liver salts. There's some, we need the gritter, don't we? That's, the gritter? Yeah, there's loads of salt on the back of his lorry. Right, I've got to just whack this all the way down again now. There you go. Uh, that's weird. An ad interrupted. The oh yeah, we do have ads. We have to make a living. We went. We go through this every time. I, I've got right. Breathe. Don't breathe. start shouting and swearing like you did last time. It's only loopy loo. It's only loopy loo. <laughs> only loopy loo. <laughs> Claudia's just choked on a chocolate. <laughs> Why? Well, oh, I think it's when you got that out. I heard that's the second thing she's choked on today. Uh, Sandy says it could have been my Wi-Fi. Uh, Shaky the gent, lube the cube. Waiting to hear, you can't say that. You can't say that. Uh, Kelvin's laughing, I don't know why he's laughing at. Uh, still laughing about the chocolate in the bath. <laughs> That's, right. That's not the only embarrassing thing that's happened to me, to be honest. Uh, last week... Uh, you all right? Uh, last week... Sean was going to the shop. Now, from our, if you know where we live, and, and most of the stalkers do, if you know where we live, you'll know that as you come out of our house, there's basically just one road. It, it kind of comes out of our drive, and then it's a, a long road, isn't it? Yeah. Down to another road. Uh, so when we come out of our house to go anywhere, we have to go up and down this, this road. I say road, it's like a single track. Single track, yeah. It's just like a single track. Uh, so he was going out to get to the shop to get, I don't know, goofballs and, and smokes or something. And I was taking uh, Otis out, or Ollie, one of them. Oh, yes! <laughs> I know where you're going now. And it was dark. It was about, I don't know, half past six, seven o'clock, and it's still dark here at that time. So I, I goes out with the torch, and we're, I'm walking down this, this, this quiet country track, and, and he's down at the co-op. What are you doing? I'm just replying to Sue. Don't mind us. It's only it's important. So so he's he's gone to the shop and I'm walking uh, one of the dogs down the track down the road. Uh, gets about half a mile down the road and then turn around and, and walk back again. I put I put my torch on for you so you okay. can demonstrate. Uh, and so uh, I, I turned round and I'm walking back and I'm about halfway home and I I see the car lights. I see Sean coming back. Because uh, it's only us really that lives around here. There's a couple of people elsewhere in the Glen, but there's, there's only really us. And I see, I see the car coming towards me. So I thought, I know. <laughs> so I stood at the side of the road in the grass, and it's pitch black. So I got the torch, 
and I just shone the torch up like that. And I squatted down like a gorilla and made like a really hoo, 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 hoo <laughs> face like that. And it wasn't Sean. <laughs> He's no idea who it was. I had no idea who it was. It wasn't one of the neighbours. <laughs> they didn't stop. But I did have a look on Facebook over like that weekend just to see if anybody had posted like this 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 strange man having a poo at the side of the road. Yeah, this deranged man squatting and taking a shit while his dog's looking at him. Oh so, dear. Yeah, that was uh, that was a bit embarrassing. Uh, Sean Graham, hello. In hello, your, Sean. In your vlog, you mentioned more travelling. Any yes. thoughts on where you might want to visit? Yes, we actually have plans, which I don't want to talk too much about. I want it to be... Yeah, we don't want to give it away, do we? A bit of a surprise. Uh, what can I? What can we tell you? Uh, we, are, we are going back on the water, not to live. Not to live, it's just... Short and, period. Yeah, we are doing a, a, a series, shall we call it a series? A series, yeah. A series of vlogs uh, over the summer, uh, which will be on the water. I'm not going to say what or where, so you can guess and speculate. Uh, so that's coming, and we're also doing something a bit different. We're doing a couple of... I think you'll find it really interesting. It's like a documentary, but it's like a documentary with, with us. Yeah. So it's it's going to be daft. Uh, but it's going to be interesting as well. I think it's going to be interesting anyway. What do you think? Yeah. I think that's it. And we're going back to Edinburgh. We've got to go back to Edinburgh. We've got to go back to fittest kilts, haven't we? So we've got to try them yeah. on, make sure that they're, they're, they're correct. Because mm. that's where we've got them from. Yeah. Uh, I, Tom says, I always wonder how much a creator gets paid from a paid YouTube subscription, as I'm a paid subscriber, as can't stand the ads. Ah, right, yes. You, yeah. Yeah. I don't know what we get from that. I don't think we get a lot, do we? No, we we get like a flat sum that, it, that there is a like an algorithm and there's there's a way it's worked out, but I I actually don't know uh what it's it is. Zero, I think it's something like 0 0.001 pence. Yeah. Something like that. It's uh, it is it, it's not a lot, but uh but yeah, it's sorry. I'm just trying to. What are you doing? I'm trying to find something, uh, and I can't do it while that is doing that. Right, that's okay. It's all right. I'm just trying to change a setting. All right. Uh, so yeah, it's it's not a lot, but we do get we do get a little bit from it. Uh, okay, everybody asking about the train barn. Uh, go over to at the train barn on YouTube, and uh, any updates will be on there. Uh, a few people saying we're freezing, so I don't know what's going on. I just checked our internet, and our internet is, is actually good, so it yeah. might be a little glitch with YouTube. Uh, we didn't say it was a canal series, Roy. No, so we didn't. here we go. Don't start assuming anything. You know what we're like. Uh, it is not going to be what you think it is, I don't think. Uh, please come to Cambridge, says Katie. I'm a chef, and I can cook you both my special two-course meal. Sean's hoping it's either pie or fish and chips. Fish and chips. Aren't you? <laughs> or curry. I love curry. Uh, a vlog about Edinburgh would be ace. It would, but it's been done. Yeah. When we got back from Edinburgh, all we saw was was reels and of, of, of Edinburgh on, yeah. on everything. Uh, yeah, I think... Right, we, we a couple of people are talking about freezing and glitches. We've got... Sometimes when YouTube wants to play an ad, it can glitch. Uh, sometimes in certain countries, certain internet providers can have glitches. Uh, a lot of people saying we're not frozen, so I'm not going to do anything else about that. Uh, James says, get YouTube premium, no ads. You can do that. We still get a little bit of a cut of that, uh, so, that so that works as well. Right, I just want to quickly, because uh, we mentioned this last time, uh, talk to you about our new gallery. So, Ooh, yes. uh, as I told you last time, we've uh, I've upgraded the gallery on our website. We used to have about a hundred photos on there, and it was all just the English canals from when we started up to about uh, six months before we we moved off the boat. Uh, so I updated that to the, the boat in photos right up until the end. And then divided it into galleries. So yeah. I'm just going to show you what I've actually done. Let's see if this works. Uh, so if you go on the website, that's our website. 
Uh, if you go up to gallery, just up there, and then click that, that will open the gallery. And you can see I've divided it into sections, English canals, Scottish canals, Highland landscapes, wildlife, the dogs, the northern lights. Uh, let's click on Scottish canals. And then that opens up that gallery with all the photos. Just click on a photo. Uh, and then it'll give you all the choices on the right hand side of, of how you can get them um, as uh, digital images or prints. Uh, and then there's the photo on the left hand side. So there's literally hundreds of new images in there in the galleries. Uh, it's foxesafloat.com uh, forward slash gallery. Now we did mention uh, if you are a Patreon of ours or a YouTube member, we did mention that we were going to do something for you and we are... About halfway half, through about it. Ha we're about halfway through. I would say about I'm about halfway through, yeah. So the difference on the Patreon gallery, the reason we've done it separate for Patreons is that we can't have a discount code on our website gallery. And we want to be able to offer Patreon and YouTube uh, members a discount. And we can't do that through the website. So we've actually set up uh, a specific gallery on Patreon. So if, this is our Patreon page. Now go on the shop. I'm just circling it there. And all the images are in there. So you can just scroll down and all the images are in there. Uh, there's pages and pages, but we're only about halfway through. So keep watching and more will appear. Uh, all you do is, uh, if you see an image you like, is just go to it, click on it, it will open it up. Now there's no like prints or anything. This is just digital downloads. Now the thing for Patreons is that A, for all tiers of Patreon and YouTube members, they're about half the price for the digital images as they are on the normal gallery. Yeah. So by being a Patreon or a YouTube member, you get the images, digital images, full resolution. Uh, you can download them at half the price. If you are a super fan, which is the highest tier, you can basically download all the images you want for free, <laughs> which is amazing because it's like five or six grand's worth of high resolution images for you on there and you can download it all for free on there. I know Tom's already probably starting now. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, if you want to know more about Patreon or YouTube members, just go to the video description in this vlog or any of our vlogs and it's not far down in the video description and there's links on, on how to do that. Right. Uh, Look who's there. <coughs> Diane Taylor. Diane Taylor. Hi Colin and Sean, thanks for the mention. You both look well, apart from Sean and his liver. Yes. Uh, miss you guys on the cut. Sending love from all aboard. Olive, you are literally one of probably two or three vlogs, uh, boaters that we still watch. Yeah. Uh, and and, and you got to give Josh a cuddle because he does an amazing... I mean, you all do an amazing job, but, I mean, his, his production and everything is You're just... You're awesome to is, watch. He's just brilliant. We, we love you. I think the last time we saw you was... Oh, no, I think it was... We were coming up to... Uh, is it Fradley Junction? I think it was about Fradley Junction. It was around that area, I think. I, th I, I might be wrong. I can't remember. I remember meeting you there, but we might have met somewhere else as well. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, give 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 them a follow. Uh, absolutely brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Nice nice to hear from you again. Send our love to everybody. Uh, Sandy says, now you've mentioned the gallery. All I can hear in my head is the vision. do be do be do be do 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 do, 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 do. <laughs> that's going to be everybody's earworm now that's over 40 or 50 anyway isn't it yeah yeah you got to be a certain age to remember that uh chris Hoffman says after listening to yesterday's vlog i was wondering if you were moving i don't think they are right. skinny dipping in the river forth get locked up for the full monarchy in edinburgh no we're not moving to edinburgh we're not moving i did have a look at property around edinburgh but yeah, we, you did. we're not moving to edinburgh we, we do like it up here edinburgh is a nice place to visit yeah uh, lots of other people saying no no streaming. Claudia says, new gallery is stunning. Thank you. Uh, Christine says, checked out the new gallery. Really like it. Thank you. Uh, Jennifer says, some of the photos would make great jigsaws. Uh, th I'll tell you, I'll be honest with you, the only reason we're not doing jigsaws is some good friends of ours, Joe and Michael from Minimal List. They do it. They do jigsaws, and we just we don't want to tread on their toes. That's it. Uh, but... You they... can buy an image yeah. and then make your own jigsaw with that on an, on someone else's site. Yeah, you can do that, but we, we really respect Joe. Joe and Michael were two of the people who inspired us to start blogging. Uh, and too many people copy other people yeah. on YouTube and they try to make a living out of it and we totally don't want to step on their toes. That's right. So, that's, so they've that's got the their jigsaws reason. and their maps and all that sort of stuff. and Yeah, yeah brilliant. 
Oh, what not to do? Hey guys, just bought some items from your Amazon list. Yay! We'll be doing a Kaylee Cruiser and the Caledonian again for another seven days later this year. Cannot wait. I'll tell you what, the Caledonian Canal it's amazing. It's amazing. I think after I don't I don't want to compare it because like the Peak Forest Canal is an English canal in Derbyshire, and the Caledonian Canal is like it's it's, it's, the, it's the Great Glen. Straight the Great Glen, doesn't it? The Great Glen, and they're totally different. And I love them both for totally different reasons. But the Caledonian Canal is just the most amazing experience because it's not a canal as you imagine a canal. No, because you've got Loch Ness, yeah. Loch Oik. We've done vlogs on it. Go back yeah. and look at the, at the Caledonian Oik. Canal vlogs, and I can highly recommend it. And uh, what not to do, they're using Cali Cruisers, Cali Cruisers. Cali Cruisers, yeah. Who are based in Inverness, which is great because there's a couple of higher firms on the Caledonian. The great thing about Cali Cruisers is that it it's starts in Inverness. It's easy to get to. It's, it starts in Inverness. You've got the trains, you've got the airports, you've got the buses. So you can get there via public transport. You can get an Uber round to the uh, marina. It starts at the beginning of the canal, so you go from the beginning down to the end at Banavie at Fort William. And then back. And back again in a week, 10 days, maybe two weeks if you want yep. to take your time. Really recommend it. The, yeah, these these awesome. guys know. Uh, so yeah, do that. And thank you so much for getting some stuff off our Amazon list. Uh, shall we put that back on? If you want to... Get, you wanna, if you want to treat us to anything on our Amazon wish list. Yeah, yeah the, the hens have run out of worms. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, Colin's been tuned to the sound of Ebenezer Good by the shape. <laughs> oh, gone how far behind are we? Uh, will you be adding some photos from your wildlife camera to uh, the gallery? Right, so, the, the yeah, the wildlife cams are not that great resolution-wise. No, they're not. So they won't be good enough to, to have digital images or prints made out of. They, they wouldn't be good at all. Uh, but I'll be honest... They're sat there. The, the the wild cams are sat in front of me because the weather has just been so bad. It's been shocking. And we've also had uh, SSCN, the electricity engineers, cutting a lot of trees, uh, trees and bush and stuff down. So we, we've actually taken them in until the spring. We're going to put them back out in a couple of weeks. Uh, so the footage hopefully we'll get from them will be sort of late spring, early yeah. summer. Plus it's been dark 24 hours yeah. a day <laughs> and it, yeah. through the winter. Yeah. Sorry, Tony Hart. So, so we 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 where the gallery you is missed, now, uh, aren't we? You, you missed. Uh, I think you missed Tony Adams further up. Did I? Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. I couldn't do that. Hi, Diddley Ho, ex neighbourinos. Hello. Hello. Uh, Tony Hart. Sandy Humby's laughing a lot, isn't she? I think she's had she too, does. too many gins tonight. Uh, Vision on. Uh, yeah. Game. Yeah, I love that. Uh, Christine Harmon. Really love the live chat. It's so nice to personally connect with you from across the pond. Have followed you from the Beningin. Beningin. But are you all right? You, yeah, you gonna, sat like you're uncomfortable. Yeah, and I'm going to go get another drink, a smaller drink, and I'm going to let the dogs out. Do okay. you want another drink? Can you get me another, just that much, not that much Johnny Walker, and then kind of lemonade? Yeah, I will. Some yeah. ice. Careful, because it's a bit wet underneath. Yeah. No, you're a bit wet underneath. Ah, oh, my legs. <laughs> you all right? Yeah. Don't show them that. When I picked him up last night, this is. Th stay because the, they won't believe me unless you tell them it's true when I picked him up and I didn't realise he'd got in the car like this but when he got out of the car I noticed his belt was completely undone and the Pussies. whole yeah, the belt was completely undone your fly was open and you, it was open you'd basically you'd gone for a wee you must have gone for a wee before you came out and just not even oh my god yeah really yeah honestly oh embarrassing oh my god it were hanging down by your knee. Oh. <laughs> oh dear me. He was bad. I tell you, he was bad. I have never, ever seen him that bad. The closest we ever got to him being that drunk was when we'd not been together long. We, I think we'd been together maybe a year, two years. And my, my ex-stepmother, long time gone, was at our house and it was the first house we lived together in a little two up two down in Castleford in Yorkshire and she came around one night and they got through nine bottle nine full bottles of red wine between them in one evening so it's like four four and a half bottles of wine each and he was sick as a dog can you see see the water stain on the microphone sorry 
Ah, right, where are we? Uh, Trisha Granny Leo says, uh, Me too, I followed from the start, but only recently commented. That's fine. Virgin comments are absolutely fine. Uh, what not to do? This is our third time doing the Caledonian. Cali are fantastic. Cannot recommend them enough. We've been to see them. We went to see them. I can't say much. We go, we're doing some work with Cali Cruisers this year. That's all I'm going to say. Uh, and we are going back to the Caledonian Canal. So there you go. Spoilers. Uh, Jennifer Sherwood says, I haven't got a QR scanner on my phone. Is there another way I can see your Amazon wish list? There is in the video description of this video and any video of ours. Just go into the video description. Uh, and there's like a little description of what the video is about. And then under there, it's like how you can support us and things you can do. And our Amazon wish list link is in there. If you can't find it, tell me. And I'll put it, in fact, shall I put it on the chat wall? You're going to have to bear with me because I'm going to have to find it. Uh, right, I'm going to open this up and I'm going to... I can't see you now, so you, you could actually be doing literally anything. And I don't know because I can't see what's going on. All I can see is is a white screen and Amazon. Let's have a look. Uh, right, here we go. I'm going to put the whole section on. Right, let's see if this works. Shut this down. Right, so if you go onto the chat wall, I'm going to put a load of links. So we've got links for our Amazon wish list. Has it worked? No, that's not worked. Oh, that's rubbish, isn't it? Ugh. Right, you, you can copy paste the link there. It says the Amazon wish list, and then there's a link. You might have to copy and paste that link. Uh, and then there's the uh, Beehives one as well. I don't know why that's on there. Anyway, there you go. <laughs> uh, Jennifer, your camera should just scan it, says Rhonda. Yeah, if you don't know how to use QR codes, basically get your phone, turn the camera on on your phone, and then point it at the QR code, and a little link will appear underneath, and you just touch that, and it opens up the link. There you go. Uh, has come on screen okay? Oh, good. That's good. Uh, who let the dogs out? <laughs> trying to sing you are lucky he did not wee in the car i tell you i am lucky he wasn't puking in the car that was i was more afraid of that because he has a pad on because of his prostate cancer so he, he has little leaks like some ladies do uh and so so he has the little he has the pads on to do that uh but yeah it, we, when we were driving home i mean it's only about five minute drive home but he was like oh slow down slow down it's like a roller coaster and i'm like oh no open the window ready uh roy says has come on screen okay good good yes it has worked good christine says good uh trish oh, oh colin how funny thank goodness sean has you there to keep him i was worried to be honest because i've never seen him that bad before and he don't look after himself as much as he should. You need to nag him for me. Because he don't look after himself as much as he should. I think I stress him out too much. So I think he eats and drinks too much because he gets stressed with me and he vapes. and It's a bit unhealthy, but I know I stress him too much. There you go. Uh, so I, would, I, just, I just worry about him. Uh, what not to do, Colin? Kelly told me last year they were hoping to work with you guys to do videos for them. Uh, yeah, shh can't say much uh, Colin when you go onto camera one just noticed a YouTube certificate above you you mean that one uh, yeah so that is our uh, they sent us that plaque when we got a uh, hundred thousand subscribers which was ages ago I think ages ago uh, yeah somebody about Sean, just look after him. Say nice things to him. People are always saying, oh, Colin, you're good at this, and this photo's good, and that video's good. Give him a, give him a bit of nice. Are we going to have to do an intervention? I don't think it's that bad yet, but we might have to. Here you go. Thank you. We're actually talking about you. Me? Yeah. I can't tell you why. <laughs> Shh. Don't tell him, Pike. <laughs> what are you talking about? Oh, look, it's Fiona McKinnon. We can't tell you how we know Fiona McKinnon because, as well, you know, right, shall we tell them the story again? 
Right. Now, look, Fiona, because you might not have you might not have heard this earlier. We were telling people earlier about the wedding, and about how you might not know this about how how people some followers are ringing around trying to find out where and when it is. Yes. And some people are actually trying to find the caterers. I think you know the caterers, and we know the caterers. So if anybody rings or you anything about us that's suspicious, get in touch with us first. Yeah. I think we've just given away that Fiona's doing our cake. <laughs> so, <laughs> so Fiona is like the best wedding cake maker. Yes. Up here in the Beautiful Highlands. Beautiful cakes. And she is making our wedding cake. We're not going to show you, so don't even ask. We enjoyed all the samples. <laughs> yeah, she sent loads of samples. We put some on social media. I think we put some on Instagram. Uh, and then she sent us some more samples. Yeah. I was like, we can't even make our mind Too up. Too many to choose from, but we've chosen them. We're not going to tell you what they are, no. what the cake's going to look like. Yep. No, she says, I, <laughs> I wouldn't say a word. <laughs> uh, but yeah, the cake is going to be amazing. Shamazing? I can say shamazing now. Oh, hello, Fiona. Ooh, I'm glad Fiona's really there. thirst quenching lemonade. Oh, we love you too, Fiona. Yay! We've got to say that because she's making our wedding cake. <laughs> no, we really do. We really do. Uh, Carol, all your subscribers are organic, never been bought, so we'll done, well done. Well, the the you can always tell the people who have bought subscribers because you look at the video views. It's like we've got like Ribble Link, which has just passed, I think, one point one million views, and uh, a lot of the stuff we do. And then you kind of you see these that have got like. A million subscribers and they they write something on social media and get two likes mm. <laughs> you just think hang on a minute what's remember, going on do you remember there? the other week when i had to block 500 oh yeah we got we got bot spammed by some chinese on company Facebook. and we got like it was all like uh well they thought they were like sexy young chinese girls didn't they yeah and they were just like completely spamming us with followers and 500 comments. follow new followers i had oh. to block Sat there all day going block, 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 block. Uh, welcome back, Sean. Thank you. Love Sean's fits of laughters. We love Sean. Yay! What <laughs> have you been you talking guys? about? Sean, you're adorable. What have we been talking oh, about? Oh, look. This is ace, isn't it? Sean, we love you so much. All the hard work you do around the croft and Sherlock Pugh. No, his name's Sh Sh Sherlock, Sherlock the Owl. Pugh. I think she means to say Sherlock's muse. All right, not pew pew banny McGrew cuff but dibble and grub. <laughs> so so come on, what have you been saying to get this reaction then? Sean, you are Collins Rock. What is going on? You are nice and stiff for me like a rock, <laughs> aren't you? You're co definitely Collins Rock. Come on, uh, tell me what you've been talking about. I'm just telling people how, how, how nice you are. All right. Uh, Victoria Sponge will be. He's to send us some more samples. I think we need more samples, actually. No, we I, don't. It I, costs I, her money. I, I actually... <laughs> it costs Fiona money. We'll send you 20 quid. What, <laughs> what, what can we have for 20 quid? <laughs> Somebody's just bought us some on Amazon. We'll sell that and then give Fiona the money and get some more cake samples, can't we? Uh, he still doesn't look 60. Oh, thank you. This is tricky. 65. <laughs> mm. uh, Lazar says, are any of Sean's former Navy mates attending the wedding? Uh, no, because I, uh, I'm not in touch with any of them anymore. Don't know where they are. So I'm going to be up at two o'clock weeing now. Aren't yeah, I? you will, yeah. Ah, uh, here we go. Sandy says, cake, now we're talking. <laughs> uh, it's so obvious when people buy it. really is, isn't it? You see it so much. Uh, you were in the military. I was. You can't say much. <laughs> Can you? No, yeah, I mean, people ask like questions. Oh yes, yeah. We did when we went to Edinburgh though. We did. We did. I took him to see uh, Royal Yacht Britannia. Cause My used, old ship. You used to work on there. I didn't used you? to work on there. Yes. And he liked that. And the thing that I liked that, that was in the foyer. There was a big. Lego Royal Yacht Britannia. Yeah. Now, you can't really see this. Well, there's two things about this photo that you need to look closely to appreciate. Uh, one is that I'm taking the photo and I'm actually naked. And if you look really closely, you can probably just see a reflection that you wouldn't want to see. Uh, but the second one is how big it is. That must have been, what, about 10, 11? It was massive. 12 foot long. It was absolutely huge. Made out of Lego. I like Lego. Dave Greenwood likes a bit of cake. Oh, Alfie Barlow Alf loves me. Alfie Barlow loves Sean. That's another one in wedding bed, isn't it? 
Uh, positive <laughs> affirmations for Sean. Didn't Savage Garden sing that? <laughs> Sean suspicious. I am, says Robin Barrett. <laughs> and Philip Izzard's laughing at something. Anne Barnes loves you. Oh, Fiona's making muscle. She's got her poster so good. Is oh. she's expecting twenty quid in post now? Though, <laughs> yes, isn't she? she probably she's will. Going to be yes. approaching envelopes and saying, "I aren't sending them until this twenty quid comes." We'll have to pay for them. Cause... What, what do you mean a postal order? <laughs> God, when what last time you used a postal order? I do they still. I don't know if you can still get. Can you still use them? I don't can know. Can you still get postal orders? Oh dear. Uh, Angela says we have a friend here called Sean Fox. They could be twins. They uh, look so alike. He doesn't live on the uh, Trent and Mersey Canal, does he? Because <laughs> we've already heard that one this week. Uh, we all love Sean, says Kelly McCurdy. What oh, you've been saying? Name that is. I've been saying how how good you are to me. Have you? Why? No, to, honestly, they will tell you if I'm lying. Okay. I was just saying how good you to me and that I was worried about were you when you got paralytic. Oh, God, yeah. Uh, Philip Izzard is 60. Ooh. Ooh. Uh, Seamus Sean, well done, I. What? I think you mean Seamus Sean. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, Steve Grubb's the last one down the fireman's pole on Trumpton. Yeah, Pew Pew Banning McGrew, Cuthbert Dibble and Grubb. Yes. I bet a lot of people don't know that either. Uh, Reese Holmes says, uh, "Hey guys, uh, watching you. I thought he was really, really stocky, and he's not. He's holding a trophy. <laughs> yeah, he is, yes, that's a big trophy. Is that you? That must have been a right competition. <laughs> but tell us how you won that trophy, because that looks massive. I bet that weren't for trampoline. It looks, it looks like a football trophy. I think he's just holding it. Yeah, yeah." Uh, Catherine says, "You definitely don't look sixty, Sean. Wait until you're sixty-five, like us too." <laughs> It was lovely to meet Time's you. Time's going by too quickly. We had a lovely breakfast with Catherine and Tony yesterday. We, we? did. A lovely breakfast. Uh, Coffee Spurs says, I think the official secrets act does, don't expire. Did you say it? Did you sign it? Yes, I did sign it. And they know it doesn't expire. Now, you trust Aaron, don't you? I do. Nothing to worry about, Sean. Don't be suspicious. Is Mitch up? Hello, Mitch. You were waving at wrong camera then. Hello, Mitch. <laughs> Uh, Sean, take it while you can get it. I don't know where I'm looking now. <laughs> I've confused myself. Uh, don't be silly, says Fiona McGinn. What she really means is no postal orders. <laughs> Cash only. <laughs> oh, no, that's not true. Don't believe... Because you're bloody gullible, a lot of you. Don't believe me. Don't believe a word I say. Free cake. Yay. Uh, Timothy says... Uh, Sean, how many years did you serve? I was in the US Army here in Germany from 78 to 83. I did 1980 until 1988, I think it was. I think I did seven or eight years. Yeah, seven or eight years I did. <gasps> Excuse me, Brad. Joined right? up as a boy straight from school. What, you were having an asthma In 1980. Attack, it's, uh, 16. I've got hiccups. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You need a shock. I need a shock. You need a shock. I've been sleeping with Lewis. <laughs> That's not a shock. <laughs> <laughs> no, I haven't. Again, there'll be canal forums again tomorrow. It will, now. yeah. Colin's been sleeping with Lewis, and they'll, they don't know who Lewis is, so they'll no. me, they'll make it up, won't they? they Lewis will. from Narrowboat Poker Summit. Yeah, they will. I they? don't know. Uh, Lewis Irons, and no, I'm not sleeping with him. Not for the want of trying, but there you go. Uh, <laughs> What to try? What not to do, says Colin. I, I nearly snotted then. Colin, I got a new drone, a Swell Pro. It can take off and land on water. Going really? to be so cool. Well, my Mavic Pro can land on water. It carries on once it's landed, but... <laughs> it's no good afterwards. <laughs> it's no, you have to go retrieve it. <laughs> uh, Clay Cuthbert says, I'm a little ahead of Steve down that pole. We need all these people. Yeah, we do. We've got Pew, Cuthbert and Grubb. So who do we need now, Pew? We need Barney McGrew and Dibble. Yeah. Officer Dibble. Uh, Rhonda says... Uh, oh, Super Chat, thank Hello, you. Hello, Rhonda. Here's a donation for more cakes. Up. There you go, we've got our $20. <laughs> Brilliant. Oh, bring on the cake. Oh. Oh, Sharon's bought us some chalky fingers from the Amazon wish list. Thank you. Lovely. Thank Looking you. forward to me... Look at... I think it's Sharon Bamber coming to the wedding. They are, they are Mr. and Mrs. They, Bamber. They are Looking forward to meeting you. They are coming to the wedding. Uh, Jenny Sherwood, you two bring out the best in each other. We do, actually. I think I think we do. 
I think we're like a well lubed machine <laughs> as we get going, aren't lubed. we? Yeah, I was going to say oil, but then I just saw the bottle of lube at the side of the computer. <laughs> And we've already had a lubed cube, haven't we? Yeah, we have. So there we go. Uh, Noddy says, I'm near Edinburgh. Would love to meet you for a cup of tea. It's a five-hour drive. For us. Watch the vlog. It's a five... Bloody, and it's a long drive, is that? Yeah. Uh, Sharon says, I actually do like Sean. Well, that makes it sound like she didn't to start with, doesn't it? Uh, it's nice to see him look so happy at the croft. I am happy. You are a happy Yeah, person, I'm a happy man. You? Generally, when you're not drinking. <laughs> You're amazed. They're still going, look. And They're I have, still going. I haven't said anything, What's, have I? Who's Lynn booing? Who's what? Who's I don't Lynn know. We'll, we'll get there in a second. Catherine. We Go enjoyed on. our lovely breakfast. Just, just apologies that Freya, the tiny dog, jumped up at you. <laughs> don't. I was jumping up at us all the time. It's because I had that bottle of whiskey, that's all. You've got your awkward teeth in tonight, haven't you? My awkward teeth? Yeah, you seem to be thinning a little bit. Yeah, my brain's not working. Spitting at me. No, it didn't bother me, the dog jumping up at me. It, I just didn't want him, want her to knock that whiskey out of my arm. Boo! Boo! She's trying to make you jump to get rid of your hiccups. She's not saying boo. Ah, oh, right, yeah, I get it, yeah. Thank you for your service. Uh, what did you do in the army, says Katie? I didn't. I wasn't in the army. I was in the navy. <laughs> I was in the Royal Navy. Uh, I was a chef. Fans for the memory says, hold him upside down and give him a glass of water. You bloody well hold him upside down. <laughs> I've do I am doing my back. I fixed two dry stone walls in a year. I aren't. There's no way I'm lifting him upside down. Sorry, I'm shouting, aren't I? I can feel because my legs go in. <laughs> Sean, you have the greatest laugh. He does, doesn't he? Uh, she loves us. Uh, Katie Ritchie was in the Navy. I think we just told her that. Yeah. We? I think we just have that. She meant Navy anyway. Look, she yeah, French. you did. Yeah, I, th I thought you might have said that. But yeah, I was a chef. Uh, chef. Ooh, this is a nice one. You want this one framed? You're pure gorgeous. Keep up the laughter. Thank you, Shaky. Uh, Zenfo, hello, boys. Greetings from the Lanky. I took you up the Lanky, didn't I? Yes. 2019. We love the Lanky. It's a gorgeous place. Uh, Noddy says, post loaders exist, but they type on where it's going. Oh, they used to write it on when we were young, didn't we? Yeah. I used to send it off for when I used to buy things from the back of comics. Did you? Yeah, you used to buy, like, do you remember them fish that you used to put in your hand and it used to do that? Yeah. yeah I used to, that's how we, I used to pay postal orders for things like that. Did you? Yeah. Five pound postal order costs five pound fifty. Bloody hell. So what a rip off, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, Angela loves Sean's giggles. You should see the rest of him. <laughs> you don't want to see the rest of it. Uh, Jane says, I had to miss a large chunk of you both. Tonight. Well, there's plenty of us to go around at the moment. We're, we're actually on a bit of a diet. Well, from tomorrow we are, yes. When we, <laughs> we've been saying that for a month. Uh, when we went to have our uh, wedding outfits uh, to be measured up for them, uh, she says, do you want to kind of allow for any kind of more or less... I'm like, oh no, definitely less. We've got, got to lose some weight. So Sean's has been made in two inches shorter. His his waist and chest, not. I mean, you could afford to lose a couple of inches off that. <laughs> what? But uh, but yeah. So so he's got to lose a bit of weight so that he gets in his wedding outfit. Yes. Otherwise, we're going to have buttons popping and. It's, it's not going to look pre pleasant, is it? Don't. I tell you what. If you don't want buttons popping in your eyes, don't sit in the front row. <laughs> It's like that thing in it at Disney World. You you might get wet. <laughs> I'm gonna do that. We're gonna do. We're gonna do some at the wedding, and the front row will get wet. No. Oh, all this money. You know who's on the front row? All this family. Yeah, exactly. They're all gonna be <laughs> spitting it as out there. I think it's gonna be brilliant. Uh, we all want to see the rest of him. It says Shaky. Oh my God, Shaky. Uh, Fenella the kettle, which is not wet and happy anymore, but she does say that Sean's laugh is infectious. <laughs> Uh, Matt F says, love you guys, first time on chat, all the best for your upcoming wedding. Kisses and hugs from Wel Welburn, Australia. Uh, Melbourne, Melbourne, Australia. <laughs> I tell you, it's because I was thinking, I was thinking while I was reading that, that when we first decided to do the wedding, it was about eight and a half months away. And uh, I'm not going to say exactly, uh, but it's around six months now, yeah. isn't it? Time's just flying by. It is really flying by. Uh, 
My comment was genuine. Lol, I like you both. I was the first to find you on YouTube in this house and talk to everyone else. Oh, we believe you. We're only messy. Yeah, we only... You know, don't take, take us take seriously, us Sharon. Seriously. Uh, oh, I was just going to add that to the board and I don't think I will. What? <laughs> uh, to the loom and back, my granny and granddad bought all their grandkids. I thought that was on the OnlyFans wish list. I didn't know it was on the Foxes Afloat yeah, wish list. Yeah, okay. Uh, my granny and granddad bought all their grandkids a post order for Christmas when we were kids. I think I got a couple. I can't remember who from. Uh, Bazooka Joe Bubblegum used to ask for post orders. Are we having a honeymoon? Come on, Sean. Uh, maybe. Depending on dates and stuff, isn't it? Well, last time we said no. Yeah, we said no, but we do have a plan to be somewhere after the wedding, don't we? Mm. Or before? We don't know. Mm -mm. We don't know yet. That's it, isn't it? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sandy Humby. That's a good name, isn't it? Mm. Humby. Mm. I went to see a pub band the other week and they were and they had a snow machine. They kept aiming at the crowd. Oh, should we get a snow machine? Mm -mm. <laughs> Thomas <laughs> Tomlinson. Sean, I plan to lose fifteen pounds for wedding. For for wedding for, for the wedding for the wedding, so I gave up sweets for Lent, just for Lent. Yeah, that's the problem. If if we did that, we might lose like thirty grams, but then we'll gain that times ten when we, well, start, we start again. Eating them again. We really would, wouldn't we? Now I've actually mentioned this to Sean, and he says no. Uh, there's an idea for a vlog, Shollin Shollin and Corn's weight loss group. Oh God, no! He don't want to do that. I've told him that would be a good idea, but he, d he don't want to do that. Uh, got covered in foam. Yeah, because it's not real snow, yeah, is it? Yeah, that's the only problem, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, still loving the calendar, and it's only February. February. Just realised I share a birthday with Otis. Hooray! It'll be four this year. I know. Uh, Pete Wilden says, are you making a vlog of your wedding? No. We are not vlogging on our wedding day. Uh, we've got some photographers coming and we've got some videographers coming and they will be photographing um, and video videographing the wedding. So we, we won't be we'll be we might take photos with us with this phone but we don't plan to. I don't no. even think I want my phone on me. No. Uh Katie Rich says uh, you both cheer me up. Love watching your vlogs. Thank you. Thank you, Katie. Uh, Alice Elsa's favourite past TV advert. Favourite past TV advert. Ooh. Ooh, come on then. I'm just sorry. I'm just moving Sean out of shot a little bit. There we go. No we difference. Was, we know we are centred now. We are perfectly centred. I can see by the grid lines. My, t my mine used to be um, Martini. I mean, that's old. The one with Leonard Rossiter. Leonard Rossiter and Joan Collins. Joan Collins. Yeah, they were good. I used to like them. I don't know what were my favourite. I tell you what, there were an advert that I really liked, and I can't remember what it is. It, it was it had the monkeys in it, and they they went jammy. It weren't Martin. It was Chinzano, wasn't it? Yeah. Uh, well, that didn't go well, did it? No, it didn't, uh, did it? Sparmer says, uh, hello, you two from across the pond. Happy days hearing of the wedding and such. Is that a wire or is it just cotton? It's cotton. It's just cotton. Uh, I would love to hear your weight loss tips. Uh, Don't just eat. eat less. Eat less. <laughs> That's it, eat less. Exercise more. I used to be a personal trainer, so you think I'd be good at this, wouldn't you? <laughs> <laughs> uh, Chris's tummy is in harmony. Oh, is it, are, you, are you rumbling as well, Chris? Oh, I thought they were talking about old adverts, and I thought they were like Chris's tummy is in Harmony Hairspray because we were talking about old adverts. <laughs> Can you imagine? He must have a lot of hair around his belly button <laughs> that it needs hairspray. It's getting to that time of night, ladies and gentlemen, where Sean basically switches his humour off. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't. <laughs> Good morning from Australia. We switched on 10 minutes ago and Sean's been laughing constantly the whole... Well, <laughs> apart from, like, the last minute. 
Uh, here's another vlog idea. Colin and Sean's gym time. Lycra and socks down pants. Oh, God, you don't need to see me in Lycra. I don't need socks down my pants. I don't need socks down my pants, no, do I? No, no, we don't. Cadbury's Flake. Oh, yes, it was. Very phallic in that advert, wasn't it? Yeah, 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 it was, wasn't it? And you can't do that in real life, because it'd just be everywhere, wouldn't it? You can't... <laughs> You know what I mean, don't you? Crumbliest, flakiest milk chocolate in the world. And there she's there stroking it like some... I don't know. Uh, mine are the Hamlet ads. I oh, have, yes. I have a VHS of them. Really? It takes all sorts. It takes all sorts. Is that the same Michael Howard of the Conservative Party, do you think? If it is, ban him. <laughs> <laughs> so, give her back on look. Uh, hi boys, uh, will you say hi to Loopy Lou from us? Hello Loopy Lou. Hello Loopy Lou from Kevin Sue. Uh, we've got a honeymoon spot in just for you two in Lanzo. Oh. Oh, we didn't think of that, did we? No. Well, will you have the dogs for the three months that we're there? Three months? Well, I'm only going for a week. If I'm going, I'm going for a while. <laughs> what? I'm right, ah. Uh, yeah. You got a message as well. Yeah, it's from Sue. I'll answer, I'll answer your message, Sue, when we finish this. Uh, Sharon says, have you ever been to Glasgow? Lots of history and wonderful places here too. My hubby Neil, who has the Scotland Effect channels, will save you the trip. Just watch him. Oh, cheap plug. <laughs> My moderator missed that one. Didn't you, eh? <laughs> Neil, there must be a story about how you two met. There is. There um, is. We talk about it on a couple of vlogs. Yeah. Uh, if you go back, some of them are quite early. I think one of them is Leeds to Castleford on the boat. We talk about it there. Yes. Uh, and another one, I, I forget, but we, we've we've spoken about it a few times. It's quite a long story, actually, isn't it? Yeah, too long to go into right now. Mm. Uh, let's have a look. Lots of people saying Hamlet cigar ads. I used to love baby's heads. What? Baby's heads. Navy gravy, it's some great shit. Baby's chef. heads, it's, it's small, steak and kidney pudding steamed. Oh, so it's not an actual baby's head? No, that's just what they were called. I was starting to wonder, because, I mean, bloody eating baby's heads, passing baby's arms. What, what are you doing with these babies? <laughs> yeah, baby's heads, it's um, a small steak and kidney pudding. Another one of the baldy man, Hamlet. Oh, that's Sim from Scotland, isn't it? Yes. Hmm. No, oh, he's definitely not that Michael Howard. I <laughs> uh, love the Volkswagen Golf ad with the squeaky earring. Oh, I remember that, yeah. Yes. Our White's Lemonade. Our White's Lemonade. Uh, Pete says, Did you eat more, do you eat more on the croft than you did on the canal? Uh, I don't know, really. Not really. I think we eat about the same, don't we? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I don't think. Cadbury Smash. Oh, oh yeah, with the aliens. Oh, yeah. Uh, 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 uh. Uh, they smashed them all to bits. Kaz Jake says, please, please say hello to my daughter, Daisy. Hello, Daisy. Ooh. <laughs> and this one. Daisy. Hello. 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 Uh, Tango, that were a good oh, one as well. Oh, yes. That, oh, the bandit, them, didn't they? Yeah, I remembering them all now. Yeah, the band, that one. Uh, Narrowboat Spudley want a cheap plug as well. There you you go. want a cheap plug? Yeah, they've yeah. got a channel, Narrowboat Spudley. Yep. Yeah. Just trying to think of something positive to say about it. Are you? <laughs> oh, they're awesome. They're really, they're awesome. An awesome couple. <laughs> uh, for a great lager, follow the bear. Uh, pudding chips and gravy with mushy peas. Ooh, yeah, I could, I, I could write eat. Ooh, a nice steak pudding. Uh, Aaron says we still do your slow cooker curry. Do you? We do, actually. Yeah. We've got a different slow cooker now, though, haven't we? Yeah, because we've got a glass hob. And mm. I can't put that on there because it just scratch it to death. Uh, Maggie says, shake and vac. Shake and vac. Put the freshness back. Classic. Vans for the memories. They want a cheap plug as well. Oh, there you go. Hey, we're all going out, aren't we? We're going to have some <laughs> sponsored by messages coming up, I think. Uh, Maureen Littmans, he's got an ology. That was a B oh, yes. BT advert, wasn't yes, it? Yes, yes. Jaffa Cakes. I don't remember who Jaffa Cakes adverts. PG tips. Oh with yes, the with the chimpanzees. Yeah, I remember that as well. T, Mr. Shifter. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry, Spudley. Our moderator seems to have uh, highlighted out the word wanker. So there you go. <laughs> umbongo, umbongo. They drink oh, yes. it in the Congo. There you go. 
Uh, in the year, oh, we don't know American adverts, do we? Because no, we, we don't. don't. But but I'm sure there must be some good ones. Nimble, brass, that was oh, red. Oh, in the hot air balloon. That's too old for me. That one, but I remember my mum telling me about that. Yeah, I remember it. Yeah, uh, Amadillos, dime bars. I don't remember that one. No, I don't. No, I don't. Uh, what about the Budweiser commercials? Was that the 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 Budweiser? The frogs. Yes. Is it that one? John Smith's bitter. Yeah. Bring back Busby. Bistar. God, it's so many. Oh, yeah, Busby. There's so many and you forget them, don't yeah, you? Yeah, you do. Bist oh, Bisto. Yeah, another one for Cabris Flake. I still, yeah, she, she can't do that with the flake. Oh, J.R. Hartley. Yes, that I remember that yellow one. Yellow Pages, wasn't it? Yellow Pages, yeah. Oh, Jaffa Cake's Full Moon, Half Moon. It was the the, yes. the woman, won it, where she Yeah, I remember that now. Campari with Lorraine Chase. I don't remember that one. Yes, I do. Yeah. Another one for Nimble Bread. Uh, Matt says, curious to hear about your honeymoon plans. I'm sure something special is being planned. Well, at first, there wasn't going to be a honeymoon because no. we've got Sherlock and we've got the chickens and we've got the bees and it's the, it's. I nearly gave the date then. I actually nearly said the date. And the time of year is when the bees are extremely busy and I, I need to be seeing to them once or twice a week. Yeah. Uh, which kind of rules out us going away for any length of time more than a week, I think, more than a few days. Yeah. So we were we were looking at not doing anything. Then something came up where we might be able to have a couple of three, four, five, six days away. And then Kevin and Sue basically offered us their, 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 their kind of luxury place in the Canaries for three months. Uh, so can we take the bees to the Canary Islands? Uh, yeah, we can put them in first class. I'm sure there's a law somewhere that <laughs> preventing us from doing that. Uh, Sid, when British Gas... Have you seen Sid? If you see Sid, tell him. That oh, yes. That one, it? Oreo, I don't, I don't know an Oreo ad. Uh, but no, mind I you, Al, I can't remember that. Alf is 11, though, isn't he? So he's only 11. got a, a few <laughs> years. He's, he's 19 or 20, I think. Is he? Uh, Pepsi Max, I don't remember that one as well. No. Our White Slaminade, I remember that. Fry's Turkish Delight. Yeah, I remember, I remember that. I remember that one. Nothing sucks like an Electrolux. Yes, I remember I, that. I remember that one. I think that's the one that turned me, is that one. <laughs> uh, Cadbury Caramel Rabbit, I don't remember that one. Harry Bo with the police. Of, I, I know that one. Oh, yeah, I know that one, yes. God, we got. Shall we just walk? We'll come back in half an hour when you finish talking about it. Yeah, well, I think shall we will. We? Yeah. I'm going to have a drink. We, uh, what time is it? I'm going to be up at two o'clock weeing. Yeah. Nothing sucks like an Electrolux. I won't be able to get that out of my head now. <clears throat> they're, they're still going. I know. Budweiser is known for the big horses. Uh, Sue and Kev, dogs, after Otis kicked me out of bed to snuggle up with Sue, sadly it's a no. <laughs> Damn it. So close. Oh, dear. Right, I think we're going to wrap this up, aren't we? I think so. We've we've done our two hours. We've done our two hours and seven minutes. Uh, right, we, we'll wrap this up. Let's uh, let's let's get rid of Kev. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Kev. <laughs> I could say something about Kev, and I'm not allowed to say that either, am I? Why? Because of 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 of. of ah, right. Oh, a lot of you might not have seen this. We're not going to tell you what this is now. We'd be traitors if we did, wouldn't we? We would be. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Oh, I wonder where that is. Oh, don't fade away now. <laughs> uh, right, I think that's it for tonight. Oh, dear me. Oh, thank you for joining us. Yes, thank you. We've had a wonderful evening. Uh, we've got some interesting vlogs coming up over the next few weeks and months. Uh, plans been made. Uh, so more from that next week. Have we got out to tell them? Uh, so. Somebody, I was just somebody was asking about the wedding. Right, so the wedding. If if you want to come to the wedding, we'd we've released it. I don't know if they've gone yet. I haven't checked my emails, uh, but we're releasing some wedding packages. If you are interested, uh, go to foxesafloat.com and then click on the shop tab, and the wedding invitation packages are in there. So foxesafloat.com and then click on shop. 
if you are interested in the new gallery and all the hundreds of new photos we've added to gal the gallery, you don't have to buy anything, you can just have a look, a look at the photos, uh, then go to foxesafloat.com and then click on gallery. So everything's in, in the website, we've, we've refreshed it a little bit and it's a, a lot better than it was. Uh, so that's all them. Uh, we'll be back next week with our latest vlog. I think we'll be live again in a week or two, won't we? Yes, we will, yes. Until then, take care of yourself. We'll see you later. Bye-bye. Ta-da! No, you go! <laughs>